Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Please be so kind and give me a second. One more second. I am sorry for running a little late today. I am. Believe me, I am. But we can get this show on the road. Just give me one more moment to finish my last few steps of setup. There we go, and there we go, and now I just need my headphones, and then we can start rolling. How is everyone doing? Almost through the week, almost through the week again. <laughs> sorry if I'm still if I'm feeling a little tired. Well, sorry if I feel as, as I feel my sound a little energy low, at least at the very start of this, but that should fix itself. Once we start going, oh, I'm, just, I'm so sorry. I need to mute myself again because I'm getting a call. So sorry. Okay, so I am so sorry about this, but here we finally are. Hello, everybody. It's Thursday evening. Work week's almost over, so let's go out with a bang. Let's go out with some more Elden Ring. So by going out with a bang, I mean doing exactly the same thing as usual. If my hair might seem a little weird to you right now, it's because it's still wet. I had a long day at work. I've only been home for a little more than an hour, so I had time to prepare my dinner, eat it, take a quick shower, do my stretches, and now we're here. So, let's load a game. As you might see, there are a few more characters here. I didn't do much, but I did do a little thing. Your girl Chaos is the character my girlfriend made to test out the game. And Cloud Frollo is my second character that I finally created for when I ever want to play offline maybe. And or if I ever want to go for the strength faith build I so desire. That's why I went for Cloud Frollo. But neither of those are interesting to us right now because we are going with our boy Hosus. We are going to hose it down. So, as always, we have a couple of things we want to do. <sighs> ah, just a couple of things. What are the things that we want to do? Well, first things first, we are still in the middle of the tower with the strong mage. And I have been thinking about this fight for a bit. And the solution I came to is kind of that if we are going to beat it, we would pro I mean, we could just run past it, but I do want to beat it most- Oh, right, I forgot. Mostly because I want to see if the other NPC drops something interesting. It feels like an NPC that probably drops something rare. Something specifically good for a sorcerer, in the, to be exact. And just for that low possibility, I want to kill it. But, as we've already seen, it is quite deadly. So, as a little try again. At long range, range, and at close range. So, what we're gonna do, what we're gonna do is... Oh, you're starting with that one. No. So, what we're gonna do is get rid of your ghosties first, and then... Oh, okay. And then we are going to stay at mid-range because we have seen 
you being actually more dangerous at the close combat than you are at the ranged combat. I don't know why the mage is stronger at close combat than at long range combat, but I am not one to... Whoopa! To complain about it too much mode. Ow! Okay. Can I drink up and roll? Okay, I can't drink up and roll, but I can roll! And a one, and a two, and... Oh, okay, I'm, I'm running out. Shit, shit. Get, roll, roll, get away. Ah, all right. So we fucked up there because we tried to cast a spell when we were out of magic. But the concept still applies. While the mage is actually trying to cast arrows, he's way more vulnerable than he is at close range. I don't know if he would teleport a second time here. And I'm pretty sure we just learned that we can't really heal while we're in combat, so if I ever want to heal, I need to get behind something. And I guess the same goes for Estos Flask, so I definitely should Estos up. Well, Est are the other ones called Estos? I mean, they are neither, none of them are called Estos, but you know the concept. I don't think I can summon ghosts there, right? Hey, could you move that lift? Don't think we are able to summon ghosts in here. Yeah, does not look like it. So what we're gonna do is drink the flask and then repeat the first step again because the first step did work quite well. Oh yeah, if you're staying behind there that works for me as well. Yeah, okay. Please stop. Oh, and please don't drop my frames, game. I need those frames right now. I literally need every single frame you can give me. Yeah, okay, and whenever you start casting, just start wailing. Okay. Okay, you got out. You got out, but this is going all right so far. So the problem is, what am I, am I going to do around all your ghosty ghosts? If, oh, okay, if you could spawn and walk all the way over to me. That would make my life a lot easier. Because I think I want to get rid of all of you before I try to get over the bridge again. And one last cast. And you know what? You know what? We are going to heal up again. Preceptor Miriam. Your time has come. Oh, okay. That's not the spell I need you to do there. But that's alright. Can I... Oh! Okay, we were too greedy there, but we should be lit. Ah! I thought we would be able to interrupt her before she got the shot off. I thought we would be able to interrupt her, but no, we definitely need to roll through a shot and immediately cast. Or maybe start casting before she even starts casting. I don't... I haven't figured the timings out just yet. But the principle applies, the principle applies. We do have our winning strategy here. Now the only problem is applying it, but the general concept works. We found a way to get rid of the ghosts, we found a way to get rid of most of her health once we engage with her. And I doubt that she's going to teleport again. If she's teleporting again, then I might reconsider actually fighting her. I'm going to be completely honest. If she's going up and into the next area and that this just keeps go happening. Mm. Okay, I think I want to save the flasks of wondrous physics for a little. And oh, okay. Shit, I don't want to see you. And let's roll. Let's roll and hope for the best. Oh, okay. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. That allows me to wail. Come on. Come on. You know you want to do it. Yeah, there you go. That's what you want to do. That's exactly what you want to do. Oh, and that's not what I want to do. I hate how long the animation... For you to finish realizing your out of mana takes. Okay. Drink up. Wait a second. M maybe rock. Oh, is she getting out of there? No. I want to try rock sling at least once 
just to see if I can get it in there. Okay, you're trying to do that. Now I'm going to for this. Okay, you're getting out. Fair enough, fair enough. Good. You are all the way over there again. That works for me. That works for me. Because now I just need to trigger your ghosts. And then get out. Oh, those curve. I did not know those curved. It's not too hard to deal with the ghosts. At least all of those, those are one shot. Oh, no, I don't want to fire the prospect. Or at least not yet. Oh, God. Whew. Wait, can I roll out of the animation of wondering if I still have magic? Because if so, then that might be a game changer. Why do you have so much more range for that spell than I do? Huh? That doesn't seem fair, right? Come on, come on. Whoppa. And one more. Oh, no. Okay, and now we go. Now we go. Now you have fucked up, Miriam. You have fucked up. You fucked up now. There we go. Wait, no, no, don't move aside. Don't move aside. And there we go again. Okay, so we can do a little more there. Oh, and she teleported away. Okay, she's up there now. I mean, she's not at the upper floor yet. So I feel like we can still fight this out. Are there any more ghosts here? Yes, there are. You go. Do you have a... Wait, what the fuck is that? Oh, it's more of the hand things. I didn't even notice those here last time. Uh, so, do we think she has another ghost coming up here? And a one, and a two, and... Oh, okay, yeah, she do does have a few more ghosts around these parts. I need to refill. I kind of need to start saving a little magic. Because... We are starting to run low. I say, and I immediately miss a bolt. So you do have one last guy back there. But he's slowly lumbering over. And you know what? Let's give him his time. Let's give him his time. No need to rush this. No need to rush this. Wait, what the fuck are you aiming for, my lad? I don't quite understand. Okay, and now... Okay, we find... Oh, and she's out again. She is out again. Holy hell. You are an annoying lady. Do you know that? Are you aware of the fact that you are very much annoying? Also, my game is stuttering again. Also, I want my lamp on. I mean, we forced her a lot higher than we've ever done before. I do kind of worry that she might end up fleeing into the rafters and I really don't see us defeating her if she ever goes to the rafters. If she stays on the upper library level then maybe, but definitely not in the rafters. Are you going to wait for me up there when I get out? No, not yet. Let's be careful, she's somewhere around here. I don't know where that will... Oh, over there I see her. Okay, Prospector, if that's your real name. Well... Okay, please don't disappear again. I do want to finish this right here, right now. Yeah! We did it! We finally defeated her! Ooh, and we've gotten a spell for it! Now that's something, that's something. Alright, we finally murdered our way through the lady, and I will just assume this girl, girl does not respawn. I wasn't 100% certain if we could do it, but as it turns out, we were very much able to do so. And I kind of want to recall just to refill my my flasks, but at the same time I don't really have much to lose right now so I might as well just press ahead press on and see what's happening here also let's unequip the staff the so the last time I got killed here I got killed because reds dropped on me so let's try to avoid that this time around Let's be a little more careful, hmm. 
So there's a ladder over there somewhere, if I remember correctly. And be very careful about the rats. There are two rats up there. Are you going to come down here when I move around these parts? Or are you going to just... You know what? I don't think I need to care about it now that I think about it. There's nothing else left on this level, so we might as well just climb up and hope for the best. Fight them even eyed on their left. Oh, what the fuck is going? Is this a guy? I don't think this is an actual guy, right? Please don't let this be a weird guy. So, rat, if that's your real name. Oh! Bad rat. Bad rat. Okay, and the other two rats have aggroed. Come on, come on. Don't be impatient, just kill them one at a time. One at a time. And the rats are gone. The rats are dealt with. I don't see another one. So I think we are safe to move on. I just want to see this guy is actually... Okay. He's not targetable and he's not hittable. And he doesn't climb up behind me. So I'll just assume we are alright to proceed. Yeah, nothing's moving. I'm kind of worried that I saw those hands. Ooh, I don't know what that does, but it sounds nice. And Cerulean usually tends to mean something good. Because Cerulean means magic shit. There we go. And what does the rat down there do? Does it have any way of getting up to me? No. Okay, so the big question is, do I have a way of getting up? further up because there still is something here hmm does not necessarily look like it read message bow required ahead but seek look carefully bow required ahead is there something we could target but seek Look carefully. What do you... S oh, wait. Okay, I think I see what they might be talking about. So, let's see. I might need to equip a bow real quick. And I'm very much not proficient with bows. But I think I can still shoot at least one arrow off. Wait, what the fuck did I just... Ah, yeah, there it is. So, and now, aim. Wait, are we aiming? Is this a magic bow? And we did not quite hit the thing I wanted to hit. Kind of wish we could target it. Maybe it's because it's a crossbow that I can't aim it, so in that case I need to equip something else. I should have a bow, though, somewhere, right? Don't tell me I never picked up a bow. I vaguely remember having something that I could use to aim. Ah, yeah, that's this thing. So, let's see. Is this something we can actually... Um, okay. Is this because I can't use the thing I have right now? Is it be Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, we almost fucked that one up majorly. Uh, what do you fire? Oh, ballista bolts. Okay, that would explain it. That would explain it. So let's hope that actually does something. It moved me back a few inches, but other than that, I don't see anything that changed here, sadly. Where is my my trusty telescope? Hmm. Bow required I had. I thought we had to maybe shoot the thing in the middle, but now I'm not so sure, because the crossbow bolt definitely got stuck in there. Oh no! Ah, why do I always do this? 
I always press B to cancel out and I always jump back and this is the first time I think I ever had to pay the price for it. Okay. I mean, I'm definitely going to get my souls back. There's no discussion about that. Because they should... Well, where are they going to be now? I don't quite know. They might be in the place the, where I died, or, the, or they might be in the place where I dropped from. Hmm. Either way, and also let's just make sure I don't didn't pick up anything to use on that pedestal. Something fits on this pedestal. Don't know what, but definitely something. Something definitely fits on that pedestal. Hmm. But yeah, if we can't get that... Uh, well, we don't seem to... Oh, wait. What the fuck did I just see over there? I think I saw something down there. Hmm. I mean, there are those hands hanging around the lower areas. Do we think we could jump down there? Does this look like water you could walk in? I will ask you. Maybe this is a situation where we need to roll out of the lift. I'm certainly willing to try it, but first I want to get my souls back before I squander them on an ill-fated attempt. Goodbye. Goodbye. Those things do give decent souls considering how easy they are to kill. Like 200 souls per shot is something I can definitely work with. I didn't miss anything here during our fight, right? No, that's just... Just decoration. Just a couple of decorations. Nothing less and nothing more. Hello! And the next one, please. Bring me another! There we go. I think I'm missing one, right? Weren't there three more around these parts? Ah, yeah, there's the last one. I knew another one would be popping up. Okay, so let's pull the lever and let's get our souls back. They should be up there, which is annoying because it means we need to m murder the rats again. And then we can recall to the esters and, well, to the, to, the, to the spot. And see if it gets us anywhere. And if not, then, well, then we know we can leave the tower for now until we finally find out what the heck we need to actually get through there. And also, we at least got a new spell, so... I definitely want to try that one out. So, def so I'm very happy that we did decide to actually fight her and not just run past her. I had a feeling she would drop at least something I would be interested in. That's always the thing, if you fight something that is similar to your own class or your own playstyle, it always is the feeling of, hmm, it might have something for me. Maybe. So, okay, I see my runes. They are up one level. Wait, is there another rat down there? No. Uh. Okay, I'm starting to understand that this is probably some kind of gravity puzzle. Even though I don't quite understand how yet. Bad rat. The ill-fated video game Bad Rats makes a return. So, hmm. Could of course take another look around upstairs, but I don't know, it does not feel like we have the tools to do what needs to be done. Whoop. Hey, one shot. So, there are our runes. There are our runes again. The rats keep wandering around, but we don't care. We no longer care okay, officially. <sighs> first off, just getting started, all the more first off key. Okay, you are showing down. So I will assume this is a good hint telling me that the key is down there somewhere. So, we will try to see if we can do this rolling jumping thing there. If we can unlock another hidden path from the side of the lift. 
Because there was a blood stain there and that kind of unnerved me and made me think this is not going to be the right way. But maybe, maybe the whoever that was died from unrelated causes. That might be a little too optimistic thinking, but I mean, the worst thing that can happen is that we are dropping our souls very close to a bonfire. So n not too much to worry about. Not too much to worry about. And yep. read message. No jumping ahead. Hey Sleepy, how you doing? So you're telling me no jumping ahead, but I see a hand here. Okay, that hand might have just fallen off into the void. I see another hand here. I kind of want to give it a little tippy tap, a little laugh tap. Elden Ring before where? Sounds like a good plan, sounds like a good plan. In my case, it's more like Elden Ring after work. <laughs> ah, you know what, before I stare down this abyss forever, I'm just going to jump it at least once. And the answer is, okay, this is definitely not a survivable jump. The camera change does tell me here that this is a, de a definitely killing you jump. <laughs> Okay, so I guess we are going to pick up our souls and then get out of here. There's no reason to hang around this little tower any longer. Which is a shame because I don't like leaving things unfinished when it comes to dungeon, dungeons. But at the same time, I think we might have hit the cap of what we are able to do here. That kind of looks like the Radan's helmet. Also, I found out I can crush boss memories, and I am probably going to crush the memory of Godric. Because, let's be honest, I'm not going to buy either of the items we could get from Godric's memory. Come on. There come our runes. It's so weird, I would have sworn that this would be the place to further explore this area with the hands and all. That does make it look like an actual area, but no. We'll have to come back here later. So what else was left for us? What else was left for us? Ah, yes, I do remember a few things. If this is... Okay, wait. Is this the right one? This might actually be another one. This might have been the one with the stone giant over there. Because we did have that one teleportation spot that was in the ruined city with the big guy that wasn't talking to us and that weird black gold statue outside that was a boss fight and i feel like we could probably attempt that one again if we really wanted okay no this was definitely the other one i don't understand where the where the first one had gone to i'm pretty sure we had a grace leading up to there I mean, if we didn't, I vaguely remember the teleportation spot being around here, maybe? Oh, that's something we could do. And there's one more thing we uh, I, I can think of. We could try to do the semi-boss thing in the castle in Stormvale. The one last thing we have not done in Stormvale. That was on my agenda for the day as well. The big alien rotting tree thingy. But before we are going to attempt that, I am going to spend these souls on a spell. A new spell, because we haven't gotten a new spell in a while. Well, okay, let's rephrase that. We just got a new spell, but you can never have enough new spells. <laughs> ah, so. Those bloody wolves up there. Uh, I think it was Seluvia's Rise, yeah. So, down south. Down south we go. Seluvia, my friend, I've got your money. Do you still have my magic? Or do you maybe have another quest for me? Because I did do a quest for you and nothing much came off it, other than that you are now a shop merchant for me. Oh! Have I ever killed you before, my lad? I might not have killed you yet, so just in case. Okay, nothing for me. Ah, yeah, that's the cast I crawled through, right? Yeah. I'm still missing that one emote to activate whatever needs to be activated in there. But I don't know where to get it and I'm honestly not going to scour the internet just yet to find where I find a bloody emote. 
His quest, that was one thing. Um, could you get off the horse, please? Hello! Yes. So, you do have a lot of spells there. And I do have a lot of cash right now. So let's go for the strongest one. The Carrion Phalanx. Intelligence 40, 34. I do want to buy all of these because I don't know what any of these do. But for now, this is the only one I really want to get because it's the most expensive one. So might as well. Might as well. So, and with this... The entire northern area of Stormvale is kind of done. A friend of mine, by the way, told me today that he was able to bypass Stormvale entirely because apparently you can get through to the other side through this river or something, I'm not entirely sure. He said somewhere in the water on the right side he found a way past Stormvale and I was like, ha, didn't expect that to be possible. So, mm. I think the secluded cell was the spot I needed to go to, right? Yeah, and I think there was one more path that I still needed to open up. By the bridge I also found that way. Oh, okay. <laughs> so it is a well-known fact for everyone but me, gotcha. <laughs> so let's equip some new spells, shall we? Let's equip some new spells. We never use the magic clean blade and we barely use the Gleanstone Shard these days anymore. So let's try either of them first. Which do I... F because this one just looks nice if I'm completely honest. This one might be a one that's going to stick. This does look like a lot of knives. This does look like a nice way to get a lot of burst damaging quickly. So I do want to give it a try. Oh, my knives are still there. How lovely. <laughs> Hello, you have come to the sword merchant. If it is magic flying daggers you want, I am your man. But anything else, you might want to try another merchant. <laughs> okay, so... It's between either these two or the star shower, because I never use the star shower, if I'm completely honest. I don't know, the star shower just doesn't seem to do enough to really warrant existing, if I'm completely honest. <laughs> uh... Yeah, I think we're going to get rid of the star shower. And we are going to equip the magic downpour. Let's see how you perform, how, Lu how you look. I mean, we did see the ability when our enemy used it, but let's be honest, the game does have a tendency of doing things slightly differently for enemies using abilities and you using abilities. <laughs> okay, so, up oh, and there go my knives. There go me knives! Ah, okay, we are at the perfect spot. We are in the perfect spot right now because I did see someone... Unlock the one path. I'm, well, maybe it's the one path I was missing. Maybe it isn't. We are going to find out. But you had to jump over there. Then run over here. Yes. I don't remember if I've ever been on this... Oh. On this road before. It's interesting that you can actually skip Stormvale Castle. Because Stormvale Castle did feel like an area that had... As served kind of like a checkpoint, like a proving ground where you had to uh, had to show that you're actually able to handle what comes after. But no, oh, god damn it. This might take a few attempts, so give me a moment. But at the same time, this makes me uh, feel like, yes, I never explored up there. Because I feel like I would remember dropping down a few times like this. Come on now, this is not a difficult jump. This should not be the hard part. And up uh, Ah, there we go. So, uh, now, to not fuck things up, I need to go to the left here. Hello. Alright, there's an entrance over there. I don't think we need to jump down here. I think we should go over there. Let's go over there first. And let's turn on a light. 
I kind of want to field test my spells for the semi before the semi boss happens. Ooh, okay, there's an item over there, so I feel pretty confident in saying that I have never been here because I am known to be a loot goblin. So whenever there's at least one item left, I am sure this is a path I've never explored before. So, and you know what? Let's renew these swords of ours. Let's renew these swords. Oh, what the fuck are you sh Oh, right, the small pot guys down there. I do remember you guys. I do remember you guys. Uh, there's just one little plant here. Is this an invisible wall? No. Behold flower, but still no lover. Eh, I've seen funnier. Okay, double items, no trap. Golden room. Smithing stone. Oh, god damn it. I kind of need to relearn the controls right now, apparently. Which is weird, because usually that only happens when I haven't been playing a game for a while or if i have weak forehead okay um where oh down there or maybe you're talking about this guy or this guy or this guy one of these guys i mean let's be honest they were all pretty much weak forehead oh okay you know what you want to fuck around and find out what's happening here Okay, so do you aim or do you just shoot randomly? Let's cast you a little further ahead. I mean, you are not doing bad damage. I'll give it that much to you. This thing is not doing bad damage. It's not the most precise spell, but it does something. Boop, boop. Uh, did it kill? Okay. But not the most precise, as we've already established. Manor Oh, you're still alive. Tower shield. Boop. Okay, let's keep keep going. Oh, I think I dropped something. Yeah, there we go. Okay, out here. We should we should be able to open up a doorway I haven't had opened yet somewhere around these parts. If this is actually the way I think it is. Read message? No. Hey, another item. We did miss out on a few items. Let there be head. What? Oh, I see now. No, I just want to get the item game. That's all I want from here. Oh, level 5 rune is actually pretty decent. For an area I left behind a lot earlier. Oh, is this one of these collectible paintings? Someone told me with the collectible painting that I collected that I could use it to find treasure somewhere. Which, ooh, rainbow stones, which is interesting to me. So I do see an item over there. I do see one rare item. But what's this? Oh, this might be the door I'm thinking about. Yes, this is the door I'm thinking about. All right, all right. We finally, okay, we've circled all the way back. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, okay, so yeah, we actually found that one missing pathway. So, let's get the last item and then let's head to the, towards the boss. I do hesitate to call it a boss because usually it's only a boss when it has a health bar on the lower side of the screen. But at the same time, it did murder me quite harshly a few times. And it is kind of unique and a lot of other things that do make me feel it is some form of boss. Hello, Batat at Video Games. How is my favorite cringe streamer doing? Dying inside and outside? Alright, gotcha. So, yeah, I think usually I go down from the other side. So, let's see if there is still anything lying around here. Does not look like it. Okay, so let's head down then. That's actually a pretty good way though, because I think on the last one I was forced to kind of take at least a little bit of falling damage before I was able to fight the boss. And I don't like having even a little bit of damage. It was an insignificant amount of damage one might say, but if I can avoid it before a boss fight then I will gladly do so. So let's start by phalanxing up I guess and then... Let's see how the worm is doing today. I think, yeah, there we go. 
Can I leave several of these behind? Okay, no, I... Oh, wait. Yes, I can. Ah! Okay, we are definitely way better equipped to deal with this now. We are actually doing some damage here. Come on now. Whoopa! I see you are trying something funny. Think you're a funny guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. We are not quite funny, but you are intimidating still. Although that was... Oh, was that a big explosion? Yeah, it was. And a comet for you! Damage for me, a comet for thee! Okay, is there a head I can potentially hit to knock it over? Nope! But yeah, we... Okay, we are taking you down this time around. Sadly that we didn't get a knockout there, but... We got the job done, so that's something. Oh, and it was hella worth it! Okay, I didn't expect to get a golden seed for this. I mostly wanted to do this for completions. But that's an amazing reward. That's an amazing reward. Alright, okay, okay, let me think. Now with the, with the golden seed. Is there any... How many souls did that thing give? Uh, an okay amount. But the golden seed is worth a lot to me. Okay, let's see if I can still find that one area with the teleport to the weird black stone golem, gargoyle, whatever. Ah, third church of Malika. It should be north of me if it is the position I vaguely remember it being in. Uh, ah, yeah, I think this was it, right? Well, only one way to find out. Ah, Torrent, I know, I like you, and you like me, but would you be so kind to let me get off you? Come on, usually this button works. Nope. Sometimes the controls are just stubborn in this game. There was a big patch today, I heard, but sadly it was mostly a balancing patch, and not a patch that actually resolves the technical problems of this game. So... I mean, don't get me wrong, balancing is important, but I would say the technical side of things does have priority. Ah, yes, the gray old dragon bow. Where are we again? Oh, that's where this was. That's why I didn't find it on the map anymore. I didn't think we would have uncovered a piece of the map here. Okay, you know what? We are going to rest real quick just to reset our spawn point. And we are going to try to fight this thing out there again. Uh, time to be armed and time to be d -d -d dangerous. I think I can shoot you from over here, right? Yeah, that will work out for me. Boop. Okay, we are actually doing some damage to you now. This is a lot better than it was last time. Oh, and I can summon my wolf, so I think I will do that. Ow, ow. Oh, and you are no longer one-shotting me. Wonderful, wonderful, isn't it? Ow. Okay, you are still one-shotting me with some moves. Okay, gotcha. Black Blade Kindred. Okay, but I do want to test this one out. I do want to fight this thing a few times at least. It feels like it is still too strong for me, but at the same time, it feels like it is impossible to defeat it now. And I've been thinking this might be a good chance to maybe experiment with a few of those. I have been told that I should probably switch to the skeletal militian ashes just to use them as more of a tank. And I still haven't decided on which of those to use. Banished Knight Angval. I don't know who that is, but you know what? He, has, he is going to get a chance to prove himself in the eyes of, well, me. Also, why do I have that moss in my equipment bar right now? I don't need the moss in the equipment bar right now. So, where are my souls? There they are. Where is my ang anguished knight? There he is. Where are my weird swords? Here they are. And last but not least... Where is my giant fuck-all arrow? Because that's how I like to start my fights. With a giant fuck-all arrow to the back of my adversary. Goodbye. And another one. I think we have the time for two. Oh. Oh, what the heck? Okay, you are doing things. 
Okay, the damage we do to you is not great, but it's not the worst. No. Anytime now, knight. If you want to do something, feel free to. Oh, that again. Oh, okay. You were, you were aiming for my knight. Can I knock you over? Oh, not like this. Okay, that's definitely too slow for an enemy like you. I should probably try the wolves first, mostly because they are my highest level summon. Also, I should level other summons. <laughs> I definitely should level other summons as well. Ah. So, the, yeah, the wolves didn't really have a chance to do anything here yet. So, let's get the wolves out. And they don't take as much magic, so that's also good. Oh, wait. Why can't I? Oh, because I have the shield equipped. Though I got a little confused there for a second. Well, round three, fucko. Let's see how you fare this time. And one. And you know what? Let's shoot the other one a little quicker. All right. Do the wolves do anything to you right now? Does not necessarily feel like it. Uh, but they are tanking damage. They are taking some aggro off me. And I think this is a good chance to actually use some of my meteors. Okay. No. And meteor. Because I feel like I can get a knockdown on you. Yes. Like that. Okay. That did way less damage than I hoped to. And oh. Oh, and you're getting another web mount. I see, I see. But you got rid of your first weapon, so maybe you're weaker now? And two of my wolves are down. And you're coming down for the last one. I see. Hey, he's still alive. He's still kicking. Still. But I no longer am. Gotcha. Okay, so you are doing a lot more damage with this thing, but we got him down to half health, so that's already an improvement over all of our previous attempts. Against the Black Blade Kindred. Uh, I kind of want to ditch the wolves, I believe. I should probably ditch the wolves. What would I replace them with, though? Let's go to the stronghold and see whatever we want to level up. Because as, as we already established, the skeletons are probably a better option for how I use them as a base summon. But we are still undecided on who's a good summon in general. Which is also a problem. Because, I don't know, these super summons, they don't really seem to do all that much most of the time. Maybe one of the casters would do more. The Twin Sage Sorcerer, I assume, would be good for some additional damage. But for now, let's go and level up the skeletons and try to use those for this fight. Am I going in the wrong direction as always? Gotcha. Wrong direction as always. So, but now. Hello! Ooh, I kind of want to check in with the girl we, uh, we administrated the potion to. So... Ah, uh, yes, those are the equipments. There they are. I hopefully have everything I need to... Okay, so we can only get those to plus four. Hmm. While these sound fine... They do sound fine, but at the same time, it's the situation of... Ah, but do I really want to waste resources on something that probably... Oh, she's gone. Well, I don't know what has happened to her then. Uh, maybe I want to talk to her dad and find out if he knows something. Maybe that advances the quest. If, there's... if there is something to advance still left here. Okay, it does not look like we can level up any of our current equipment. I can... Yes, we can... Rec 
Yeah, I just don't understand why I would ever level up the shields because it doesn't actually seem to reduce the amount of damage they reduce. It doesn't seem to help with the amount of stamina that's taken per hit. This kind of looks like it's collectible, but it ain't. Oh, sorry. That 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 chair. That, yeah, someone else broke that. Ba -ba -ba. So. Is your daughter around here somewhere, being weird and all? No. To the capital, nope, you don't seem to care. You may be our... the Academy of okay, no, you, you just literally don't care. Alright, fair enough. And since I don't see her outside, I guess it's time for us to go outside again as well. So... Do we want to bash our head against this guy a little longer? Nah, you know what we are going to do? We are going to go back to exploration. Oh, also I can remove this marker. I no longer need that marker. And I don't remember why I did put a marker there. I think because I couldn't enter there yet again because I was missing an emote. So let's leave that one where it is. So the big question right now, yes, that's the mark I was looking for because that's the marker of the new area we unlocked in the Calade last time. So let's explore the Calade a little. It's been a while since we've been in the Calade and there's still much to see in the Calade. The last big area here around the, I would say, starting zones that I haven't really explored all that. Well, you can't even say that I haven't explored it all that much. At this point, I explored a shit ton about it. Okay, I don't know which of these directions to go would be better, but let's just head left for now. Because I remember coming up... Oh! That's a giant undead bear. I don't like that, because the basic bears have already been quite a nightmare to deal with, so... Oh yeah, you are... You are tanky and you do... Alright! That's a bear and a half. That's kind of how I expected this to go, if I'm completely honest. I saw this bear and was like, let's give it a shot. But I wasn't hoping for too much and I... I was still disappointed, let's be honest. <laughs> but yeah, that's a big bear. That's a big bear. I'm going to try this one again though. I'm going to try this one again and chuck the flask of wondrous physics first. Maybe we could... Why is my left bumper not reacting so much right now? Is it the game? Is it my controller? Is it something else entirely? I don't know. So oh, big bear. Oh, no, no. No, nothing here. Does this count as cover? I'm not sure. Nothing beneath those glowing swords. Oh, wait, that's not the button I wanted to press. I guess we should give it a shot in the most literal sense. Come on, and the fight starts. Oh, no. And the fight has almost ended. Ow, ow, ow. Come on now, big guy. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, no reason to be so aggressive about this. You didn't like the attack. I see. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it, my lad. My chat. My giga chat. Ow. How much damage? Jesus Christ. I don't. Well. Maybe we should go right. You know what? Maybe going left first was the wrong decision. Maybe right is where we actually want to be. The right side seems so much more promising right now. Who even wants to tangle with an ugly old zombie bear? Nobody, exactly. So we are going to collect my souls and then book it. I am no longer dealing with this bear, I decided. Hey, give me those. Here we go. So, what does the other side have for us? Hopefully not more painful death. I would hope for something that's not painful death, but knowing the Kalade, it will probably be more painful death. Yes, trigger all of you. Give me all the free souls. So, what the? Oh! Alright, I see. I mean, that's another version of painful, I guess. No, 
Don't aim at me, don't. Ow. Okay, get up, get up, get up. If I remember correctly, those can't really aim beneath their feet. So as long as I stand here, I should be, yeah, I should be safe. Unless he, of course, changes his tactic, which he might be unwilling to do. Okay, are you going back to bow tech? Yeah, you are actually still using the bow for reasons unbeknownst to me. You are sticking with that bow and then you are stomping again and okay, this will be a very short fight if you... Oh, and you have fallen and you can't get up. I mean, you might be able to get up, but let's see if you are going to get up while wow, on this. And can I still get to the chest to finish it? With a style... Oh, come on. Okay, we didn't get the stylish finisher, but we finished it. Hey, item. Great arrows. I don't need those. What do we have? Okay, I need torrent. Yes. Is there some... Oh, there's another one back there. I was wondering why the battle music kept playing. Ooh, that one looks cool. Looks like something we ain't ever gonna use, but it looks cool. Hello, big guy. Oh, here. This is where we are. That's great. I wanted to check this area out for the longest time. But this is how we get here. Hello. I would dismount if the game let me, but for now I'm just going to slash your ankles a little bit, alright? Okay, finally. Let's go back to an actual fight. Are you going to try to use that bow again? Okay, right now you seem to not know what you really want to do with your life. Don't get me wrong, I understand it. We've all been there. I don't know why he got stuck there. Oh, maybe knocking him over is actually a bad thing right now because we removed him being stuck, but he's almost dead anyway. So no reason to worry about it. No reason to worry about it. Golem great bow. Sounds powerful. Okay, let's head for a little look around before we head over there. Because that's the area I really wasn't sure how to get to for a while. Because I thought we would be able to get here through the mini dungeon we were in. But that's the one mini dungeon I never actually finished because I can't find the bloody door I've opened in it. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything here, so nothing else to do but look at the big pot, I guess. So the question is, will the big pot be an enemy or a friend? So far, I can't target him. Oh, I don't like these sounds. Are there any bird monsters? Okay, you don't seem to be an enemy, I would hope. Oh, ha! I mean, you're a big guy, so I guess it's normal to talk from over there. Hello! You can now see the Knight of Great Char's red summon sign. What? Oh. Alright, so... Are what the fuck is that helmet? Okay, I guess that's a thing of oh, we have to kill these guys can i get around you and inside this fort somehow maybe 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 and uh, no do i have to kill the guys i just summoned to prove myself worthy is that what's happening here it might be well you know what i have never been above uh, killing a few guys to prove my worth so why start now so, whom of those do we want to fight, though? You seem like a bleed guy. You are another caster. You know what? I think we didn't have a good caster fight in a while. So, let's prepare. Let's ready up. And then it is time for a good old-fashioned caster fight. Um, where is my adversary? Ah, there. There you are. You, ju you just took your sweet time. Okay, you are, you are using magic as well. Again. Well, again, what am I talking about? You are using magic as well. 
I mean, we, we didn't know that much. Ooh! The explosions, okay. Oh! You know what? We are just going to slash at you. The casting didn't really work out for us all that well so far, so we are just going to slash for a while and... No! Oh, okay, we stabbed you. We stabbed you. That's... Ow! You are a strong foe. I do have to give it to you. Ooh, move away, move away and then start casting because so far we haven't done much casting in this caster fight. We've kind of tried to be a sword fighter here and it didn't work out for us. Did not work out for us at all. Ow! Ah, yeah, okay. This... Ow, and you're getting the shield out. Ow, and... Uh, ay, 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 ay. I kind of hoped you would roll because you... Okay, now you're just starting to block now. Ah, yeah, that's what I want to do, you to do. To try rolling from a delayed attack. Ow! Ooh, okay, we are still alive somehow. Oh, and we are dead. It was pretty close, though. I feel like we can defeat that guy. I don't know what it's going to do for us to kill that guy, but we might as well try. At least for one of those guys and see what happens. Ah, yeah, we're here again. Do the big giants respawn? I'm not 100% with the stone golems, because some of them respawn and some of them don't. Let's see. Do we see big blue glowing arrows? Okay, so they do respawn, so killing them is not actually going to do much for me. Come on, don't aim at me, don't aim at me. Okay. And now let's hurry it up. Nope. Okay, lucky for me, they can't aim for shit. The problem is, though, I don't know... Ah! Ooh, oh, that's bad. Well, there goes my souls. And honestly, I don't really want to have to kill both of them every time for every attempt, so... We found a dead end for now, I would say. Because I don't know if we'll actually get something from completing those PvP spirits. So, so, we lost 10k souls there, which is a little annoying, but let's see what the other direction has to offer. We are not going to fight the bear again, hell no. We tangled with the bear twice, this time we're just gonna run past him. I mean, I should have done so in the first place, let's be honest, that's what we did. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh, this is where... Okay, so there's pretty much nothing behind the bear. This is pretty much a closed off area. Because, yeah, I do know this. We did find the stone sword. Was it an imbued stone sword key or is it a regular one? I, f I hear something that sounds like a bear. Is it still following me? No. Right? No, okay. So let's take a look at my key items again. I, I honestly don't know if stone sword keys are counted as key items though. Uh, okay, there's one stone sword key. A single stone sword key. So I assume that's the one we just picked up. And we'll also assume that there just isn't another one for now. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, oh, also I should probably check my talismans, because I think we picked another one up at some point. No, and I remember now. Wait. Ah, honestly that's not bad for me. That might be something I might be interested in later on. If I ever raise my FP again. Well, my FP scale. Yeah, my FP. Hmm. Okay, so if we consider this area also to be just one more dead end in a way. I guess the next big thing would be... No, that would be Ra Rauden. I mean, we still have this little area left. We did try to fight the boss there, but let's go for the Great Bridge first. I want to have a little bit of more look around this area before I decide... If we're going to either fight 
Farden or whatever the other one was called. I think if I remember correctly, if I remember correctly, this is where it leads to two more dragons. Two more dragons that I might want to tangle with. Problem is, both of them are in the same place. And while I am quite adequate at killing dragons by now, two dragons at one might be a little much. Also, I do see a little bit of a church over there that I never went to. And while I'm more of a man of intelligence than faith, I am... Oh, this is not the dragon we killed. Yeah, this is just a dragon. This area is literally crawling with dragons. I know. Ooh, what's down there? Ooh, a sight of grace. That's always great. That's always sight of grace. And what do we have here? A little bit of an item graveyard. That would be nice if it wasn't an obvious trap. So, where's the ob... Who's gonna spring the obvious trap? Golden Rune 6, always lovely. Last time around, I got attacked by a giant ghost giant. Well, no, it wasn't really a ghost giant. I did fight a ghost giant as well. But here it was just a giant troll giant with a flaming sword. Nothing else. Not a ghost, he just popped into existence when I caught near. Hmm. Was that all the items? Sometimes they are a bit hard to see from certain angles here. So that's why I like double checking these places, but no. Looks like we've got everything we needed to get. So, what do we have down there? Can we enter this thing already? I think the last time we found a tower like this, we had to do the turtle puzzle. Is that... Mid-fall I was like, wait, is that too high to fall off? As it turns out, yes, it was too high to fall off. I mean, we did fall off from it, so it wasn't too high for that, but it was too high to fall off safely. But, nothing to fret, we can still go over there and just look for a new way. I think I saw something akin to a bridge. Yes, there is another bridge here. Hmm. Would it be easier to get there from my side? This might actually be a situation where it's easier to get there from my side now that I look at it. We still need one more golden seed as well to upgrade my flasks, but I'm in no hurry when it comes to that, mostly because right now flasks rarely ever are the issue. There are a lot of issues going on, but it, they, don't, they don't tend to be flasks. When something gets me killed, it most of the time is more something on the line of a one shot, so... Oh, what the fuck? Oh! Oh, I remember you guys! Oh, you are still... Oh, you are still horrible! Yes, I remember you guys being horrible. Okay, so I have to ignore those. I mean, I don't have to ignore those, but a group of those, considering their damage... I mean... Mm, Nah, you know what? We can fight them. We can fight them. I just shouldn't do it from horseback, I believe, because being on horseback makes it harder to dodge certain attacks, in my opinion. It's better against attacks that you need to get out of the way of, but it comes when it comes to iframe attacks, being on a horseback actually sucks. Oh, I do hear them. I do hear them. They definitely did spot me. They did definitely spot me. This is another bridge, but it doesn't look like a dragon bridge or anything of the sort. Are the guys still following me? Uh, it doesn't look like it. So are there any enemies around this part? Oh, it's one of those that's sealed with a magic door. Okay, what's the condition for opening this magic door? There's always a condition. Sometimes it's an emote, sometimes it's a magical key, other times something entirely different, like killing three invisible turtles. Lennis Rise. Try High Road. Okay, I assume what you're trying to tell me is that I should find a way of jumping into this. Let's see. And... Okay, that's... Oh god. Oh god. 
All right. Okay, that didn't quite work out for us, but I did kind of perform poorly there. So, let's try it again. Uh-huh. Ah! Ah! We did it. We ignored the magic door. Nothing to worry about when it comes to ignoring magic doors. Please be a talisman or something else that's good. Ah, I knew it. These towers tend to have those memory stones, so we can equip one more spell. I don't know which spell I would equip right now, but it's nice to have the option. So, and with that, I don't think there's... Hello, Chivap and Chichi! Nice to see you again! Been a while, been a while! How are you doing? Hope you had a good time! Hope you had a good time. We are just exploring stuff right now. We finished the northern area of Stormvale and we are kind of trying to wrap up the Khalid right now because I'm trying to not fight Rowden right now or whatever the big angry general guy with the very very small donkey was called. <laughs> but hello, hello. Hope you're having an excellent week so far and if not then I hope there's an excellent weekend ahead of you. Okay, so this leads further down. What's the balcony doing? Okay, the balcony is just a pretty balcony. Nothing to see here at all. Can we even leave this house from here? I don't know if the magical barrier will be reset if you're entering from the out. What the fuck are you? Ugly, that's what you are and soon to be dead. Doing fine, hope you're doing too. Ah, oh, that's good to hear. That's always good to hear. I am doing pretty fine. I did have a hard day at work, but that's mostly because it was a 10 hour day. Other than that, it was good and I have a great weekend ahead of me. <laughs> ah, but that's nice to hear. That's nice to hear. Ah, oh god, I'm not looking forward to fighting Raoden again. And this thing seems like it will take forever to kill, but I want to see if it drops something. And we can kill it quite safely, so why not kill it? Mm, maybe I should try a different spell. Maybe the spell is the problem. We are only doing a little over 200 per shot. Can the Glintstone Comet do more? No, the Glintstone Comet does even less. Okay. So I guess we are going to find out if we are if this thing is going to run out of life before we are running out of mana. We still have three more flasks ahead of us. So it took us two flasks to take it down so far. Do we do more damage with in melee? Oh yeah, we are doing way more damage melee here. Melee is the way to go for this thing. Uh, how does a magical sword strike count? Okay, so it's just very resistant to magic apparently. Melee is alright, but magic is not the way to go against you. Should have figured with a thing that's kind of a floating face off, that kind of cries magical resistance, if I'm completely honest here with you. <laughs> but then again, I did think the same things for about the slime. And the slime wasn't all that dangerous. Also, I was kind of worried that it would be dif more difficult than melee thanks to the mist. But it's not really doing all that much, is it? Hmm. Did that do anything for me? What this? Likely joy. What is? These little things here? What's this? Nothing here. Okay, so was that thing literally just guarding the entrance? You were there a few hours ago. Ah, that's nice to hear. <laughs> it's always fun to hear that, uh, where you guys are at in your playthrough. In a spoiler-free way, of course. <laughs> but especially fun when you're in similar areas than I am. Hidden path ahead. I don't believe you. Yeah. I don't believe you. I did try it. I did give you a chance there. But you let me down, man. You let me down, my man. Okay. So, with this little tower done, we did get a new memory slot, so that's lovely, but there's nothing else around these parts. So, what we're going to do is we are going to look for the dragons. I should be story-wise around you. Ah, okay, okay. Are you also roughly 40 hours into the game, or do you have a different time? Did you explore more or less than I, mayhaps, mayhaps? So, I do want to see... 
where we can go to if we go beneath the stone bridge. And we can memorize one more spell, but I'm not sure which spell I would even like to memorize at this point. Because I think just clogging up my spell bar with things that I'm potentially not even going to use doesn't sound all that valuable to me. Hmm. Okay, that might be an interesting spell to try out. Let's see, Scholar's Armament. Wait, why can't I use this? I thought that should equip... I thought that should be uh, allow me to... Oh, is it maybe because my sword's already magic? I think it might be something like that. Should be at 44. Alright, so we're roughly at the same point then. Oh... Yeah, no, don't see any good reason to equip any of these spells then. We do need to still buy a few. How strong was the greatsword? The magical magic greatsword. I guess one of the melee spells might actually be good. Okay, that one is quite slow. I think I need something that's a little faster. Uh, what could we use that's a little faster then? I haven't really tested the piercing thing here, the carrion piercer. And the carrion stuff was quite late, so hopefully it's a good spell. Hmm. You know what, we're just going to test it out. It feels a little faster and maybe it does decent damage. Only one way to find out. So where do these roads lead me to? Ooh, down here. Don't think I've ever be. Oh, wait. Oh, God. No. Ooh, that was a vile trap. You almost got me there, poor evil stone ball. Almost. Is there another one spawning behind me? None so far, but I don't trust it. So let's get off this as fast as possible. That trap is a rune farm. Interesting. Oh god, okay, there's another one, there's another one! Ow, ow, ow! And hi Kuro, how you doing, how you doing? Okay, so it looks like they only spawned once. And at different locations. Okay, so I can work with that, I can work with that, that's not too bad. That's not too bad then. What are we going to do about... Oh, a lot of people actually died here. So the first one we were just able to jump to the side. Huh. I do wonder how it's a rune farm though. Because so far I don't see anything you can get killed around here. Also, let's plan ahead. Where can I dodge to? Maybe to the left, maybe up on one of those roots. Let's find... Ah, no, I see it, I see it. I think I should jump over... Oh, yeah. Huh, can you respawn when you despawn like that? No, it doesn't look like it. Alright, so I should watch out for small ledges, because they tend to spawn around those ledges. Oh, I think I just got some runes for something. Uh, is there another one? Usually things operate by the rule of three in games like this. Why is there a single bear here? What could a single bear hope to accomplish against the meteor mage? Yeah, you're not even a particularly strong bear. Hmm, weird. Oh, I think we just found a dungeon, but before we enter, let's look around if there's anything else outside. Looks like the road here still continues, so let's go into the dungeon first, because the dungeon usually promises a grace. Turn on the lights, and... Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do, I wanted to, to un-two-hand my weapon, thank you very much. Ah, yes, the Dragon Barrow Cave. Alright, alright. So, should we explore this one first, or should we keep on going outside? I think we are going to explore this little cave here. And see what it has to offer. 
Uh, I do hear something. I don't know what it is. Hello. Anyone here? Strong forehead, but try poison. Ha! Poison me! Na na na. Oh no! Not you! Anyone but you. Oh, I see items over there. Items. Please don't just suddenly turn around. I just want the items. Ooh, a golden rune 12. That's the biggest one I've found so far. Okay, maybe we are going to treat this one as a stealth section. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Stealth section. Nothing to see here, little bear. Nothing to see here. Just a sneaky, sneaky mage going around the cave. Oh, oh god! Well, he did see me. He did see me. I was not as well hidden as I expected to be. Maybe I shouldn't turn on my lantern while I'm here. <laughs> I still don't know if that actually affects enemy vision, but I did get caught this time around. That's, more, that's for sure. But damn, a 12 rune. I don't even know how many souls a 12 rune is going to give me. Probably a shit ton. Okay, so... Are we going to try sneaking around? Can we summon in here? No, we can't. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's let's use the flask just in case. But then... Hmm. Okay, get over here. And then hide down here. And I need my lantern. And I just hope it does not count for your vision. Why is there a two deer? Dog. I, I think everybody that plays this game needs a biology class in what a dog actually is. Pay no attention to the glowing man in the corner. Don't come closer to the corner. Move along, good bear. Nothing to see here. This is a stealth game now. You know an enemy is strong when I, a guy that just likes to bash his head against walls, is actually considering stealth to be a viable option for once. Crystal cave moss. Oh god. When this guy is the first enemy of this cave, I kinda don't even want to know who the final boss is going to be. Okay, I see an item, but let's not get loot blind. There might be a, a, a very dangerous stuff ahead. Ooh, a talisman. What does it do? What does it do? What does it do, my precious? Ah, there we are. Raises poise. Interesting. Nothing for me, because I don't even know what poise does, but interesting. Uh, is this the way? Is this already the end of this? Is this the way I came from, or is this a new way? If that's the way I came from, then we are already through this. Then this is just a little bit of a... St oh god, yeah, this was the way we came from. Okay, so I guess we don't really have any more reason to be here. This wasn't really a dungeon, more of a cave. Yeah, I think that's the way to put it. This is literally just a little cave with a talisman. Interesting, I didn't know on, as, uh, things like that existed. I kind of thought it would always be a dungeon if you find an entrance like that that blocks off your horse. Lessons learned, lessons learned. It kind of adds to the variety by being this minimalistic, if I'm completely honest. Uh, where are you? Are you going to move your ass anytime soon? Like... Any moment now, bear. I have not... F well, I haven't figured... Uh, checked out the other path over there, I think. Or are you a new bear that just doesn't move? Are you not my patrolling bear? No, I'm pretty sure you are, because I'm pretty sure th those are my runes up ahead. Oh. Alright. Oh god! Oh my god! Why... Well, I wanted to get back to the grace anyway. I wanted to get back to the grace anyway. We just saved time here. This bear is helping to save us seconds of our life by ending our life. 
Alright, so what here? This, these bears are definitely not something I can find in close quarters combat. Not with a mage build. Maybe with a strength build, but not with a mage build. I doubt that they are much easier with a strength build, but... They are definitely not the, the right enemy for a mage build. At least not in this environment. Huh, why did I just get souls? So, okay, good that we continue. Oh, now this bear outside makes a little more sense. Maybe that's a cup. I mean, it looks like a grown-ass bear, but I think we just saw a grown-ass bear in there. So that's probably just a cup. Ooh, I think that will probably be the tower we need to get to to activate Raoden's rune. Once we get it, of course. Your wish, Kuro, might actually be granted and we might have to fight Raoden today because I think I'm running out of Kalate to explore. <laughs> so, okay, we are over here now. Okay, we're on the lower levels. Uh, do I want to go to the left or the right? Uh, okay, I mean the tower is on the right, so I feel more inclined to go there for now. Oh god, that's a dragon. Why is there just a random dragon in the middle of the road? Oh, that might be a good opportunity though. This might be an opportunity to just farm some souls. We have nothing to lose right now and everything to gain. Okay, you barely took damage there. You're a very small dragon, aren't you? Why are you this small? Are you a baby? Are you a wee baby dragon? Uh, what are you going to do? Yeah, I, I knew it would be time that you are gonna get smacked down. This might just be a baby dragon. I don't know if we are going to get many runes for a baby dragon, but we are going to try. Whoppa! Oh wait, you, you completely missed. I don't think their moveset is really configured for this size. <laughs> because he seems... Oh, wait. He seems to be struggling with range right now. And take a flask. And then... Okay, if you don't do any fire braving stuff, then this is as good as over. Oh, he's so vulnerable to stuns and knockdowns. It's cute. It's so cute, my little dragon friend. I think that was... That was something. Baby dragon is done. Yeah, okay, that was definitely just a baby dragon. It was worth 3,000 souls. So, have we angered another dragon somewhere because we just killed a child? We might have. We might have. But, it might have just been perspective. Maybe the dragon wasn't small, but just really far away for the entire duration of the fight. You can't prove it's not that. So, hello, hello. Is something around here other than certain death through gravity? Mm, does not look like it. I mean, we still have a tower. Oh, oh yeah, that, 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 oh, I get it now. You are the parents. Oh, this is awkward now. You made this awkward. I mean, maybe I made this awkward, but still. Or, or are you just small dragons as well? Now that I look at you, you might be more small dragons. You don't seem all that big. Now that I take a closer look at you. So let's find out. Yeah, I think you are just a baby dragon still. Okay, that makes it a lot easier. I was kind of worried having to fight two dragons at once. But if you are just a little lad, then that changes everything significantly. And another one. Another one by us. I just want to get you out of the way so I can farm this area in peace. Well, farm this area. Loot the loot. Because considering that there are two dragons here, I would assume, even if they are just babies, that there's still some good loot there. And I also assume that even baby dragons don't respawn. Dragons in general don't feel like the enemy type that is going to respawn. I was really worried about this double dragon thing. Because I really thought this would be two adult dragons, because I've only seen them from very far away the entire time. And... Oh, you are dead already. I was like, hey, why can't I hit you? 
because there was already no more dragon here. Okay, you just to be sure, are you bigger than the other two? I don't think so, right? Ooh, golden rune, okay. Kind of hoping to get something unique from this, if I'm completely honest. But I'm also fine if we're just going to open up the way to Rauden's tower. And a one, and a two, and a one, two, three. Ah, there we go. Sometimes it takes two, sometimes it takes three. I kind of, it's kind of fun that I'm able to stun lock them with the meteors. I did not quite stun lock you there. This time it's free, I guess. Ah! And send out one more and then. Wait! Aim for the bloody eye! <laughs> Don't just slash the head! Aim for the eye! Okay. Will this spell kill you? No, not quite. Not quite. Oh, wait, that's the wrong flask. And give me a second. We are almost done with this. Thank you for your patience. Goodbye! Okay, and there go the dragons. Huh. I was worried for nothing and there was also no boss fight here, so... Well, that happened. That just happened. Ooh, what is this? Gravelstone. Uh, where are you, Gravelstone? What are you, Gravelstone? How are you, Gravelstone? Okay, it's a material for crafting recipes and a rare one at that. Don't know what it's good for, but it is rare and I have it now. And I would rather have it now and don't know what to do with it, but know then what to do with it without having it. So this is Raoden's tower and I did... I did her hear say about Raoden's tower, about the, this thing being a kind of a jumping puzzle or something like that. I don't even know if we can open it yet. Oh my god, you're tanky. You're tanky for a little bug. Hey, you don't disappear on me. Oh. And you also don't drop down. Come on now, come on now. You don't disappear. You give me what you own. Give me... Oh, you're one of the bombs. Oh, but you are still giving me loot. I am fine with you being a bomb as long as you still, uh, still have loot on you. This seems like a fine little compromise we've got going on here. So, and this is... Okay, I can... Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm getting immediate bed of chaos vibes here. Oh. Okay, what do you say to me? Look carefully, require the head, and then be wary of grace. Be wary of grace. Do I see a grace here? Hmm, so where do I want to go to? Which of these routes can I safely land on? Oop. Well, this one. Oh, I guess it is stealth time. I kind of thought we might end this in a more dignified meta, but as it... Oh, wait, you dropped something. You dropped something. But as it turns out, we have to do this the old-fashioned way of just panicking. <laughs> So, where do we have to go? There was another way uh, down there, but I guess for now we are going to climb up. And, um, okay. Okay, I see, I see what you need me to do, game. I don't know where you want me to go, but let's just give this a good old-fashioned shot. Oh god, please don't start that, because I see there's a cliff ahead of me. Uh, can I jump this? Yeah, I can jump this. With a little bit of extra speed, I can safely jump this. Uh, can I jump this, though? You know what? We can jump this with a horse! If oh, oh, I'm up here. I kind of didn't even see that. Okay. Hmm, where are we going here? Are we going anywhere anymore? I think we've reached a dead end. I think this is a dead end. I see an item down there, so I think I want to get that. Oh, wait, there is an enemy down there as well. Hmm. Do we think we can land there and take care of it? Maybe. Yep. Hey! Eh, eh, eh! Oh no! My health, my health! Oh, my life! 
I didn't know that you did this much damage with the first stab and then I panicked. God dang it. Oh my god, you're an ugly son of a gun. I only just noticed. Really should take better care of you. Of yourself. Okay, cradle. Wait. Oh, this is where I am again. Okay, where are my rooms? Uh, over there. there. Yeah, we don't really have a closer bonfire, I guess. We don't really have a closer bonfire, but we killed all the dragons on the way. No more dragons to deal with. Oh, wait, no, they respawn. My bad, my bad. So these are literally just mob dragons. I mean, it explains why they are worth so little. <laughs> I mean, are they really worth little? They are still worth 3k souls. Do the two in the lake respawn as well? Yeah, they do. Okay. Kind of surprised because I know they are just small dragons, but when it comes to something like a dragon, it feels like it shouldn't respawn, even though they are just wee baby dragons. But maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just because I've been conditioned to associate dragon with strong enemy. Oh god. No. Torrent, torrent, don't be difficult right now. Hey, no! Well, there go my dragon souls. Ah! I guess that gives me a chance to explore to the left. And also, it's a, this is a good lecture in be, being careful about where you get off your horse. Because just because your horse is standing in a safe spot, doesn't necessarily mean you are gonna stand in a safe spot there, as we just learned. It was a demonstration for your guys' sake. <laughs> oh, that one stung. I do keep losing a lot of souls today. Because I'm pretty sure at the, uh, I, I have already lost a level worth of souls. Do I even need to explore Rodan's tower right now? I mean, I'm just assuming this Rodan's tower. Am I just delaying the inevitable that is Rodan himself? Because I'm starting to think there is not much I can do anymore other than the Rodan fight. Ah, and I don't like that part. So, should I tr Oh, Ooh, you know what? Maybe I can... Ah, we found another way over here. Oh, wait, no. I definitely do want the shield. This is a shield kind of situation. This is not a caster fight here. And you're dead. Couldn't you have gone the same way the first time around? Oh, and a stone sword key. Nice. Okay, so we did everything, well, we found everything that was there to find on the left, I would say. So, let's move on. Ow! Bad guy. Bad touch. Stranger danger. Okay, so we, uh, well, no, what am I talking about? We are on the right. So, we need to go to the left now, I assume. And hopefully find a side of grace at some point in this tower so we can save time later on. A little later on. So, hmm. I guess for now we can go topsy-turvy. If I summon my horse now, is it going to get me killed? No. Not yet. Ooh. Oh, Alright, okay, there seems to be danger around the corner. Uh, why can't I get off my horse right now? Please allow me. Oh no. Ooh, be very careful. Oh, hey. You don't get up. You don't have the right. You've lost your standing privileges. Oh damn, those guys are worth a lot of souls. Holy shit, thousand apiece? For just random soldier guys? That's a shit ton. Ooh. I. Ooh. Okay, I see now the platforming section I've heard so much about. The platforming section I have been low-key dreading a little. And I'm someone that actually likes platformers, but platformers with front soft controls... Ah. At least we have a predestined jumping button this time around. Imagine having to do this with Dark Souls 1 jumping. <laughs> that would be hellish. Climb, 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 climb up the tower. 
Oh, it looks like there is an end. Oh, there is a grace here. Just check if there's anything around this corner. No. Snake, snake. I don't get it. I mean, I get the reference, but I don't get much else about this statement. All right, all right, all right. So we have found a grace in the tower. Do Can we hope to find anything more in the tower? I don't think so, but let's at least have a peek around inside. Because I kind of expect to find a door that I can't yet open or something along those lines. Oh god, there's a lot of blood stains. Okay, what's going to wait for me here? What horrible fate is awaiting around this card? Okay, it's you, I assume. Uh, do I have a special way of dealing with you? I guess a shit ton of magical swords. Oh, I lost some of my shit ton of magical swords. So how... Oh, there are several of you. That would explain it. Oh, ah, ah, ah. oh okay. Several of you is one reason for the amount... Uh, for the death count in this room. Hey, 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 hey. I'm the only one allowed to tr throw shit here. You know what? We're drinking up. We are drinking up. Blah. Goodbye. Okay, one down. How many? What are two or one more to go? Whoop. I think it was only two of you. Okay, honestly, I expected this to be... W Ooh, try... Honestly, yeah, this looks like a try jumping thing, but I want to see what's this first. Does not open from this side. I kind of expected that much. Is this a torrent for torrent? Huh. Oh, okay, so the jumping puzzle continues. Behold, done. Is this actually done? Read mess. No, this is charcoal, right? This is not done. Huh. Okay, so I will just assume there's nothing to the right, and that's why we are over there and someone died while testing this house. Thank you for leaving me a blood stain. Oh! You asshole! Oh wait, I'm not dead. Huh. Um, alright, I guess we are down here now. What do we have here? What is this? Read message. Why is it always ch Oh! Oh no! Oh no 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 no! Oh wait! Can I jump back up there? Does Torrent have enough height to jump back up there? Or do I need to jump over on that little railing? Wait, I can't summon Torrent in here, I just saw. Okay, so I do have to do something about this. Uh, is it? Okay, okay, now, now that I look at it, I don't think I need to jump up on that little thing and climb from here. I need to drop further down. Okay, an item. Are you going to break down beneath me again? Oh, another golden rune 12. Lovely. Um, oh, please don't tell me this is where I need to jump to next. Is there anything else? Anything else I could jump on? No, seriously. You expect me to land on that teensy weensy little spot there. Oh, all right, Geronimo! No! All right, this might take a few attempts. <laughs> oh, please tell me that at least there will be. A... Ah, do I do I really want to keep doing this right now and then potentially stand in front of a door I can't open? Because that's what might happen here. Oh, we can also climb up the tower. I thought on the right side would be just another way down. But as it turns out, it's a way up. What are you? Oh, you... Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. It's a tightly blocked shot. Okay, so either this will open once we've defeated Rodan. Or it will open once we unlock something else in the tower. Okay, so now I feel better about exploring the tower, if I'm completely honest. Now I feel like me doing the stuff here might actually net, give me some net gain. So, okay, you guys. There was one of you around the corner. 
So one shot, no kill, and another one. Just shoot you until your friend decides to get involved. Ah, there you are. Oh, oh, no! Oh, that was a one shot. Okay. Okay, I feel like I should do Raoden now. <laughs> I feel like I should probably head over to Raoden. <laughs> because we are in a good position right now, because we don't have anything left to lose. Maybe! Hey Marie, nice to see you. Lovely for you to join me. So, okay. Oh god. Oh no. Ah, I don't want to. I guess it's time to rename the stream. Let's retitle the stream to Suffering Radoban or whatever he was called. Uragan. <laughs> hey! Thank you for the resubscription. You are subbing again. Indeed, you are subbing again. And I thank you for it, as always. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Really, I do. I still need to order new emotes. So, allow me to... Yes, yes, yes. Am I ready for the festival? Yes, yes, yes. We are ready for the festival. Ready as I'll ever be. And for that, the cutscene will charge. We begin, allow me to paint you the full picture. And I will rename the stream in the meantime, because we haven't seen this cutscene in a while. I think a lot of you haven't been here last time we actually saw it as well, so we might as well. Oh, I already have the best emo. <laughs> Alrighty then. General Radan uh, is okay, see, Radan. Eaten from the inside by Melania's scarlet rot, his wits are long gone. Now he gathers the corpses of former friends and foes alike, gorging on them like a dog. So, there we go, we've got a new title for the stream that's more fitting. Delicious, yeah, isn't it? <laughs> you will like this boss, I think, though. I'm pretty sure you are going to like this boss because of a very specific part of his design that you are going to see in a second. <laughs> you will understand what I'm talking about in within seconds. <laughs> I mean, assuming I can reach him alive, because the last time I started this boss, it took me like three attempts to even reach him. Which sounds crazy, but you will understand once the actual fight begins. You will understand, I will promise you, you will understand. What? Were we able to summon in this boss fight? And if we were able to summon, who are, I kind of think we should try the skeletons, even though I think even those are going to get wiped out pretty quickly. Oh, all right, all right. Let's mentally prepare myself. Let's mentally prepare myself. This, this is going to be tough. This is going to murder me. We are a lot stronger than last time around. I don't remember how much strong exactly, but we are a lot stronger. <laughs> Excited to see this boss, I hope you are, because this is definitely the hardest boss I've found so far in the game. Okay, let's go, let's do this. Oh, I already forgot to drink my flask, God damn it! Hello Radan, how are you doing? And dodge! Alright, okay, run, 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 run until there's not more light under the sun! And give me the item. Radan Spears, lovely, aren't they? And another one! Hoo hoo hoo! And there comes. Okay. I still don't know what the best way of uh, evading that one because so far nothing I have done really worked out all that well. Mm. Oh, not too early! Ooh, okay, we made it through. And uh, drink the flask. Oh god! And here we go! Ow, ow, ow! Uh, where is my ho No! Ah! That's the wrong button! Ah! Alright! <laughs> so that was our first attempt! <laughs> that was our first attempt! Uh, yes, please play, pay the respect! A man has died in our midst! And you are laughing! 
<laughs> okay, I'll admit I'm laughing too right now. Ah, okay, yeah, but that, that that's rather. That's rather. Yeah. <laughs> he is the. Oh, you are approaching me, boss of this game. <laughs> It's a very interesting concept, as if the first two times I actually entered this boss arena, I actually had to figure out what to do oh, here first. The Jojo boss. I mean, he's definitely built like a Jojo character. And let's be honest, his horse also kind of looks like a Jojo animal, because all the animals drawn in Jojo look like shit. <laughs> and let's go! Okay. Okay, and you're doing this. Let's see, last time around the horse didn't work out for me here. Ah, uh, maybe it will be different now. No, ow, ow, ow. Okay, so we are here, we are here. How much damage do you take? Honestly, that's better. That's a lot better than what we did to him last time. How long are your combos again? Also, I kind of feel like there will be some- Oh god, his horse is too comically. There is definitely something going on with that horse. I feel like maybe I can kill the horse and that makes the fight easier or something like- Ow. Dead. Pillarman theme starts playing ominously. Oh, I wish I had that as a sound redeem right now. I'm not a JoJo fan, but I can admit that theme slaps. <laughs> Get good! Get good! I'm trying! Believe you me, I'm trying! Uh, oh, how hard I am trying to get good. And I thought I gotten gooder, but it was not gooder enough. I thought I got Gouda, but instead I got Gouda. And I once again, I forgot to drink my flask. Do I still have the time? Okay, this, oh, okay. I had the time, but I wasted it right away. Wasted it right away. I really need to drink that one on the outside. Come on, my man. P.H. Radan works just fine as <laughs> your papa. I maybe should not try to read chat while I'm approaching him, but what can I say? I am a social guy! I. Uh, ow, 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 okay, I think this might be. Way -ay 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 -ay. Oh, okay, we are close enough. Get on the bloody horse and get out of there! Okay, and me- Oh, wrong spell, wrong spell, that's a slow spell, I need a faster spell. Honestly, the, the carry and phalanx might be working in my favor here, now that I think about it, because... Because I do have few chances to hit him. Ooh, yeah, that was good damage there, that was very good damage we did there. And get away from him, get away from him. This is his lo it no, that what's his long combo? Ooh, you're a scary son of a gun. But at least this time around, I feel like we are actually doing enough damage that I can get through his health bar with the amount of magic I have. Okay, just be patient. Okay, he's using a stance change. He's he's doing a JoJo and powering up mid fight. Okay, I mean, oh god, okay. Very careful. Okay, now. And these are just going to follow me. Oh, and you and Zarif are going to follow me. Everybody's following me. I wish it was on social media, not during this fight. No, no. Ah, da 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 da. Okay, okay. So far, so good. He's almost half dead. Which, to be honest, is a lot farther than I expected to come. Okay, get another hit in, get two another hit in, and then get the heck out of here. And... And how long is your combo again? Oh, are you doing a shockwave thing? You are doing a shock! Ow, 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 ow. Oh god, Horthy, please don't die on me here. Please... Oh, where are you going? Oh, you're coming right at me! Menacingly! Ow, oh, and there goes my horse. Please, I need to... I need to resummon that horse. As fast as possible. Yes, no, wrong, wrong button, wrong button, I didn't want to turn on the lamp, I want to, yes, get the horse out, get the horse out, get the horse out, get the horse out, ah, bah, 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 bah. took too long to get the horse out, took too long to get the horse out, but 
this has been better. I can pretty much never get hit here. And I must have to be... Maybe I can jump over the shockwave now that I think about it. I always forget that double jumping is an option on the horse. But maybe you can evade the shockwave by double jumping. Good attempt. Yeah, honestly, I'm pretty proud of that attempt, considering it was our, like, third attempt today. And I... Ah, I forgot I can't drink the bloody frenosk. Do I have the time? And the answer is... Yes! Okay, I did have the time. Lovely. Just lovely. And... Nope! It's so hard to see where exactly you have to dodge just because they're coming straight at you okay and i really wish i could target you in the run of your two face just so i could see you while you're doing that and dodge okay i think you are going yeah you're doing it now you are doing it now oh oh i was too greedy I was too greedy. I tried to do damage there. Which was my bad. My bad. You can only damage Rodan when he allows you to do image. Oh, right. I totally forgot I had summons. The name Starscourt is really good, to be honest. Sounds so fancy, yeah. <laughs> and if he was a Jojo character, he would be the Platinum Starscourt. <laughs> but yeah, Starscourt, I don't... I think his lore was that he is the one that kind of throws the stars in time or something along those lines. I am not 100% certain what that even means, but he did it. Apparently, he's the guy that did it. But yeah, thank you for reminding me that I have summons. I, <laughs> I think one of the reasons why I always forget about the summons is because sometimes you can use them and other times you can't. And admittedly, in boss fights, you most of the time can use them. But there also have been some bosses where you couldn't, so... Kind of messes me up in terms of my mental preparation. Oh, okay, so I can start to lock on to him from here. I, how am I supposed to get away from this? Oh, okay, you are... Ooh, oh, think it, oh, oh god, we went on. Okay, we were fast enough. Uh, I don't seem to be able to summon. Oh, you mean the NPCs. I mean, yeah, that would definitely help, but I do want to see if I can defeat him alone, kind of. NPC summons, I don't have anything against using them, but I only really like using them when I kind of exhausted all the other options. The fact that we had a pretty good attempt already makes me think we could probably do this without them. Come on now. Okay, that's one hit and one hit from me. Okay, getting there slowly, but there. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, ba, ba, ba. you almost killed my horse. I think we can do two hits after your combo. Okay, no, we can't do two hits after your combo. Only one hit. From the arrow rain, you use the horse. Hmm. Yeah. I think it's probably better to use the horse the second he switches over to arrow rain. That's the only really option to dodge that one, I feel like. I, I kind of have to fight him the same way I fought Tree Sentinel, I believe. Like literally only ever doing a single hit and picking my windows for damage really carefully. Like, never go for two hits. Not even, don't even go for one charged hit. Just go for single hit and slowly whittle him down while being ever so careful. Because yes, I can survive a hit now, but at the same time, I don't know, it, they kind of are not survivable because if I ever survive it, it only ends with me getting chomped up by the combo okay okay honestly that's a good getting to him strat i think we found the ultimate way of getting to him now you slashed me once i poked you once it's fair and oh 
Yeah, that's the all one where you are going around. And only a similar one. Don't get greedy. Under no circumstances are we going to get greedy. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. This poor little horse of yours. Oh, that was greed. That was greed. Ow. Oh, my horse is still alive. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, that's your long combo, isn't it? No, it's not. Boop. Hey, that's... Oh, no. Ooh, I forgot your jumping range. But this was a good attempt. We learned how to get closer to him more efficiently. That's very valuable information. Very valuable. I could potentially... <laughs> I hope you guys like this fight. Because this is probably all that's going to happen for the rest of the stream. I'm going to be really honest here with you. <laughs> Okay, so wait. Yeah, okay, for a second I thought I might have touched the blood stain. Radan! Oh, I can actually target him from all the way over here. Okay, that's good, that's good, because that saves me a little time once he heads to the sh shower of arrows. You're here for it? That's good to hear. That's great to hear. Glad that my suffering is serving the audience. And now... Oh, wait! No! I thought you were going for the arrow shower! Why were you not going for the arrow shower? Uh, this is the first time it skipped on doing the arrow shower. It worked out still, but it surprised me. It definitely surprised me. And... Okay, we've gotten at least one hit in so far. I think the second one missed. Ooh! Ah! Okay, horse is still alive. Barely, but it's still alive. Oh, and okay. Long slash. Oh, oh god, horsey lives. Don't know how except how did I miss? How did I miss you here? And okay, that's just a jump. We can hit him once. That's just a small little bit of jump. Oh god, that's more. That's your combo. I, is it really a combo? It's more like mad flailing, if I'm completely honest. Okay, I think we can go for a double here. Might have been greedy, but it worked out for me. And you start your another combo. The bad thing is the next time he hits me, he's going to knock me off torrent. So it might actually be the end of me if he ever hits me again. And that's okay. Oh wait, that was just his charge up. That wasn't an actual attack. So I kind of missed the damage window. Oh god, Torrent is almost dead. And da 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 And the shots are coming in. No, no, no. Okay, I think he finishes this one with the big electric wave. We can jump over it. All right. I found him. I out oh Hubris. Hubris came before my fall. <laughs> ah, then I learned how to finally dodge that attack. Gave me a moment, moment of clarity, followed by immediate regret. <laughs> it was like, aha, I have the keys to the kingdom. But then Radan went, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, Radan, you're a big bastard, aren't you? But you're a cool fight. But holy hell, I honestly don't even want to imagine how that fight is with Melee. Also, Kuro hinted at this fight having some kind of special gimmick, a certain mechanic you would probably need to exploit. So far, I don't really know what that would be. And honestly, right now, maybe we are just going to be able to overpower it. Are you? Yeah, you're going to charge up. And so we are now we are going to circle you. Circle you like the ow ow stop hitting my horse. I still need that horse. Oop, ba, ba, ba. Okay, and there we go. Now the actual fight starts. Hello Rodan! I, honestly, your horse is the real victim of this fight. How, how much strength do you think this horse has to carry around this unit of a man? I only go for two shots. Not only, don't even go for two shots most of the time. Go for single shots. It's animal abuse. Indeed, animal abuse live on stream. Both for my horse and his. 
Oh, you're doing this twice. Okay. But we can hit you twice. But it's still, he would be such an, uh, an imp well, he is an impressive boss this time, but he would look so intimidating if it, oh no, I thought you were charging. Ah, I thought you were charging, but you were yelling and then jumping. Yeah, it was too early to switch to phase two, fair enough. On a honey, don't read chat while fighting. I'm sorry, it's called stream of disease and it's a real problem, all right. Uh, yeah, I mean, it would be smarter to not read chat while fighting, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Would be a real smart person move to do something like that, huh? <laughs> Travel to another location, yes. Should probably switch back to the right flasks first, though. Okay, so no looking at chat. All eyes on Radan. His eyes are over there. All the way over there, squinting at me while he's taking pot shots. And is it even a pot shot? I saw the chat move. I am not looking at it. I am not looking at it. My eyes are focused on Radan. Na -na 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 Only admit that there's movement out of the corner of your. Oh, there's another. Wait, that's just a message. And that's a jump, right? Yeah, okay. That's your long combo. Okay, and I think we can get two hits in here. Yeah, okay, two hits. Two hits. And a jump, and a hit. And another jump. I think I can get a sneaky little hit in here. I think we might have been too far away there, but still. Oh. And let's trigger another attack phase. No reason to run away from him while he doesn't do anything. But he didn't do anything. Alright, so far so good. Don't overlook how much magic you have left in the tank. And also be prepared to hell abuse the abuse him during his phase change. Okay, that's good damage there. Oh, that's his phase change. That's his phase change. Hell abuse him. Okay, that was good damage there. That was it. Oh, ba 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 Oh, okay, no, that's that. This attack. That's that attack. Oh, and I don't know if is there an is there an option to dodge that attack or is that just an instant damage move? Too early! Oh no! And a single hit, a single hit. That's all it takes. A single hit. I mean, it takes a lot more than that, but that's all I can allow myself to do. Oh god! Ooh, pa pa pa! And up, uh, big slash there. Big man, huh? Big man on his big horse. I mean, no, it's not a big horse. I think no one in his right mind. Oh, God. What are you doing there? What are you doing there? That's a new move. Ooh. We dodged it. We dodged it. And this is the farthest we have ever got. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, God. Where is he? Where is he? Why did the music stop? What's going on? Hello? Oh, no. Oh, no. What? Something is happening. Oh god, he came crashing down with a vengeance. I don't even know where he went right there. And he is... Okay, he is using meteors. He's using my move. Why are you allowed to use my move? That's my move. That's illegal. I don't like that. I am very worried. I am very afraid. This is the farthest I've ever gotten and I'm very worried. Papa! And a single poke. Ha! Got some damage in there, Radan, didn't I? Oh god, I'm so sorry about that. Oh no, and you... Ow, ow, ow. How good... Uh, okay, you're just doing that. I kind of hope your meteors are going to despawn at any point. And oh god, there they come. There they come. That's definitely not the... Ow, ow, ow. Okay, horse is still alive. Horse is still alive. Oh my god. Oh my god, please. Please don't do whatever you are doing there. Oh my god, what the hell? Why are you a tornado now? Who allowed you to be a tornado? How does your horse survive that? Oh god, no, please don't, whatever you... Okay, just this move. Horsey, you are still... Oh no, it's the... Okay, no, it's this move. It's not the shockwave. For a second I was worried there. 
Okay, need to fill up, need to fill up. I might be running out of magic now that I look at it. I might need to reallocate my fly. Ah, horses on. Oh god, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Get your bitches up. Whoopa! And regain the horses. Yes, yes, I want the horse back. Ay, 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 ay. Ah! Is there a way to turn it off in the options that he it's not constantly asking you if you actually want to spend a flask on resummoning the horse? Because the time it takes me to answer that is enough to get me killed in this fight. I was so on edge. Me too. Me too. Okay, so I will reallocate my flasks a little because let's be honest health flasks are mostly relevant for resummoning the horse right now and for pretty much nothing else so let's reallocate those uh do i have something new for the flask of wondrous physics maybe hmm Honestly, I think that, I mean, the significant damage, uh, significantly negates damage received is useful, but the restoration doesn't do much right now. So we might as well go for a little extra damage. I don't know if it will even last until we reach him, but we might as well try. And then, uh, allocate the flask, confirm. And I think I... Yeah, I do... I'm still missing a golden from the seed. So, and I kind of want to see if there's an option of turning off that question. Uh, I would assume it will be in gameplay somewhere. Da -da. No. No. Hmm. No. Oh no, he in... He, I know... Wait. Oh no, he, I not gonna do the big brain play. <laughs> Alright, so we did change our flask. I didn't see an option to turn off the question, which, lo which is a little annoying. Because that would be very nice to just save that one second. But other than that, I guess we are good to go. Other than that, we are good to go. So, go we shall. Maybe I shouldn't drink the Flask of Wondrous Physics right away now, though. Hmm. Oh. Wait. What's up with this door? Shouldn't this door be open as well? I think this door should be open as well, right? Why is this door not open? Why is this of all the doors that cannot be open. Why is this one? I can literally be on both sides of this door. What the fuck? Oh. Alright. We can definitely kill this man. I doubt that he has another face that goes beyond him coming down as a bloody meteor. Everything's going to be fine. <laughs> you say that, you say that, but you saw the man turning into a natural cataclysm and just coming down from the sky, striking me with the wrath of the high heavens. So, well, no time like the present. No time like the present. Yes, travel to another location. It was really cool, but it's still gonna be fine. <laughs> Fair enough, fair enough. Alright, Radan. Round number... I get... Ow! Oh. Okay, that's a very bad start right away. That's a bad start right away. I think that's the first time he actually hit me with one of those arrows when I tried to approach him. So, my damage negation is gone. And he is using this one very early on this time around. Oh, wow, wow. The shotgun is kind of a weird one, because it's so random if it's gonna be a problem or not. Oh no, that's a jump right. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, so charging it does do a significant really bigger amount of damage, but ah, the amount of time it takes, not sure if it is worth it. Ah, maybe if I do... Ow, I have a good charge window. Woo -hoo -hoo. 
Oh! I think that's the first time I ever got hit and lived to uh, heal up again. Alright, that's the jump. And... Oh, I, I totally missed shot there. And I didn't hit here. Okay, we do need... I think he's... Yeah, he's charging up. Okay, so abuse it, abuse it. This is the time to abuse. This is the time for abuse that's not centered around animals. Okay, so Torrent is in a pretty rough shape already. Okay, forget Torrent. I am in a pretty rough shape. Me, me. <laughs> hmm. I still wonder about that special mechanic Kuro mentioned. That, uh, that gimmick I needed to figure out. Because it still feels like a boss that you could just overcome with raw strength. I mean, I guess for a boss can be overcomable with raw strength and still have a gimmick. I guess one of those does not necessarily negate the others. I just have to treat this like the dragon fight, you know? The dragon fights are pretty much the same principle. Get hit once, BAM, you're dead! And... Ah! Okay, I've got my rhythm back. This, the, the Grinch got his rhythm back. The day the Grinch lost the, the rhythm spirit. He's destroying the Emperor's new group! Ooh, that was almost too early. Oh! Oh shit, you're doing this one again! You're doing this one again! I thought you were going for the shotgun. Or something! Okay. Okay, I've got you. Now that I've got your attention, might I interest you in your car's extended warranty? And... Jump today. Okay, charge up and shoot. Ooh, ba 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 And another one! And another one bites the dust. And then... Oh god. No! Oh god. I'm still alive, but my horse isn't. I'm still alive, but my horse isn't. I'm still alive, but my horse is not. I'm still alive, but my horse is not. Get the bloody horse out! Yes! Okay, Okay, I actually managed to re-summon the horse for once, but I also lost it very early. So I guess both these things negate each other. I should also, if I space correctly, I can oh, abuse his long combo, I guess. Okay, got three hits in there. And whoppa, I think that's the explosion, right? Yeah, that's just the explosion. The explosion is probably his least threatening attack right now. And that's saying something because it's a gigantic energy explosion. That should be threatening. And it is just not as much as everything else he does. Oh no, oh no, oh no, he's becoming a meteor again. He's burning bright like a shining star. Run, run my horsey, run. No, oh god, where is he coming down? Where is he coming down? I wish I would... Oh god. Okay, there you are. Okay, the music is back, and he is back, and everything is back. I like how the sky changes tonight! It, it, ooh, okay, I was able to outrun it. I did this wrong, but I was able to outrun it. And, okay, okay, you're doing this. But we got a few good hits in there. So careful about your meteorites. Oh, what's this? Oh, that's just this move. I am fine with this move. The thing about the meteorites that really worries me is I don't exactly know when they will set that off. Does he need to be closer to me or do they trigger it after a certain amount of time? Ow. Oh, I think that's another shockwave, right? No, that's not a shockwave. That's... Ow. Ooh, no, not my horse. Not my horse, please. Anything but my horse. Stop approaching me. I don't appreciate it. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Oh no, this is bad. This is bad. And he's coming down again. Come on. He's coming down again. He's coming down. No, that's the lamp. Why am I always activating the lamp in a situation like this? Ooh, I'm way too close. Too close for comfort. Personal space, Radan. Personal space. Oh, my Horsey is actually still alive. Oh, I didn't think Horsey was still alive. But it just knocked me off with the explosion. Okay, we are in this. We are in this to win this. We have one health blast left and... Oh, okay. Okay, don't get greedy here. Don't get greedy here just because... Oh, what are you doing? Oh, yeah, this move, this move. I see. Okay, we did good at doing some more damage. He's the lowest he's ever been yet. 
Uh, the meteorites still worry me greatly. But I can't just stop attacking him only because he has meteorites around him. Admittedly, in most other cases that would be a good enough reason to stop attacking someone. But in his case it's just Wednesday. Okay, you are very low now, Star Scourge. And you know what? Let's fill up. So just so I don't run out of mana. And a crew... Where are you? I don't like not being able to see you. Okay, I can see you again. I don't like seeing you either, now that I think about it. Ooh, we dodged. Okay, okay. Don't get too greedy there. Don't get too greedy there. He's almost dead. You have this. If you don't screw it up, you have this. Which sounds logic. No, 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 no. Oh, you asshole. You dodged me. Why can't I hit... Oh, God, no. He's becoming a wrecking ball again. He came in like a wrecking ball. Ah, oh, please, Radan. Why... Oh, God, I see you now. He's vibe thrusting. Oh, that's so cool. I'm so happy that I was able to see this before I was ending your life. Okay, magic, 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 and dodge it! Oh, that's the wrong one, that's the wrong one. I thought he was doing the big spiral. Okay, one more hit. And... Oh, oh, yes, yes, do that, do that, do that and die! Mm. We did it! Mm, 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 mm. Radan's great rune, holy shit, remembrance of the Scar Search. Oh, don't you worry. I am definitely going to remember this man. Holy shit, what a fight. Oh. Oh, holy hell. I will I honestly wasn't sure if we are going to be able to defeat this man today. Oh, that's such a beautiful visual. Oh. Ah, oh, look at that. I have no idea what that is. If it's good or a bad omen. GG! GG! GG is all around. Holy shit. Hey! That's, I think the first time I see my spinning emote in chat. Nice! <laughs> ah, okay. What's happening now? <laughs> I have no idea. Well, well, I mean, he was the last of the great rune holder that I had access to yet. So I don't exactly know what's happening now. Hello. Uh, can I get my horsey? Yes, I can. Ah. Holy fuck, what a fight. He's an excellent boss fight. Hard as nails. But I really like this fight. Activate the grace. Touch the grace. Stuff Sapphire of the Emperor looking ass. <laughs> I can tell you, you will definitely see this move more as a wild str What a sick way to fight too. <laughs> Ah, thank you. But you will definitely see why I call it a, more of a Wildstrux move. Once you uh, once you have actually fought Wildstrux, you will understand. Yeah, I... Oh, I see the moon now. Okay, so to continue your questline, I guess I have to go down to Nokron again. Alright. Okay. You don't have any more dialogue. I've activated. Hey, aren't you Alexander? Or whatever you are called. Hello. Ah, hello there. Yes, hello. It was a battle marvelously fought. You are well and truly a champion, friend. I, on the other hand, am nothing but a crock. One hit was all it took to crack me, and for my insides to come spilling out. After that, I, I hid like a coward. Honestly, most people would hide if their insides spilled out. One such as you. You're all right, my dude. <sighs> but don't you think I've given up just yet? As luck would have it, there's a veritable mountain of warriors' bodies right here. If I can just squeeze this bunch down inside me, I'll be a mighty warrior again in no time. And you know, the bodies found here are exceedingly. What? 
Who could expect any less from the very warriors we fought in the Shattering? The greatest of all wars. Hm. Just you wait and see, friend. I'll grow even stronger. Just you wait when next we meet. Okay, I'm kind of disturbed by the fact that this guy is just a pot with squeezed up corpses inside. Now we know. Okay, you're okay, you're repeating your dialogue now. That's a little unnerving, but you do you dude. At least those guys are already dead, so I guess their bodies are not going to waste. So I do want to head over there because the temple thing still looks like something. And I want to check it. Oh! 70k Okay, I'm kind of surprised on several levels here. I am surprised both about the fact that I got 70k and the fact that the flying dragon that I murdered at some point was actually worth more. That's a little sub... I don't know. Uh, ah, yeah, that's just a return to entrance. So, you know what? We are going to level up before we do anything else. Mm, I kind of want to do something about Vigor because I feel like I'm starting to get into too dangerous territory when it comes to Vigor. But I also want to keep pushing my intelligence just so I can use the Falling Moon at some point. Also, I want to see how much is a level 12 rune worth. Decent. That's what I would call pretty decent. So I need st still 5k more runes. To get another level up. Okay, roughly 2k more runes. And where are my last few runes? Ah, let's just use 10 of those. Before I switch around here forever. There we go. So, with a little bit of extra help, we got three level ups out of this fight. Oh, wait, I'm still missing. Okay, still missing one more crashed, cracked rune. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Because I don't want to risk uh, losing this amount of souls randomly by just keeping on exploring and stuff. Ah, uh, what should I level deck? Nah, we're going to push intelligence for now. Just a little intelligence. Little intelligence never hurt nobody. Okay, so I want to take a look at that ruin over there because I did to notice it at the start of the well not at the start of the fight but when he first became a living meteor i noticed that ruin and kind of thought maybe the fight continues over there he then came crashing down again but maybe there's still something to it like an item or so it's just a little too inconspicuous to not be anything right then again, there have been a few other things in this game where I thought, like, there has to be something here, right? And there was not. And the answer is, there might just not be anything here after all. Or there would be an entrance here at the foot of the ruin or something, but nope. Just a pretty looking ruin. Oh, no horse ahead. First off, dust. What? What? What the fuck is a dust? Ah, uh, no. Guess this is just a gigantic arena. Although I think I've been told that there should be something in this arena. Somewhere. Oh, also we need to go to Radan's Tower again. We need to go to Radan's Tower again. Oh. Is there something in the distance over there? Because we need to activate the Great Rune. And we still haven't activated Raela's Great Rune or whatever her name was. But at the same time, her Great Rune was kind of worse than Alexa. You know what? Let's take a look. What does his Great Rune even do? Uh, where am I storing my Great Runes again? Somewhere around here? No. Maybe here? No. Also not here? Okay. Mm, ah, okay, guess I have to activate it first. Wait. Okay, so I guess Raela's Great Rune was activated already? Huh. Ah, what a beautiful moonlit night. <laughs> but uh, when he mentioned, I don't know how he did it, it was like, yeah, I don't think anyone at FromSoft knew that either. <laughs> it, it sounds very cool, and it, it really does, but at the same time, it's like one of these things we are just not allowed to ask, how exactly did he do that? 
Okay, this, this looks like a ship I can maybe go to, but I don't remember the last time I tried going through the water. Bad things happened. Also, oh. What's that? Oh, wait, that's just the castle I've been to. Yeah, no, that's just the edge. That's just the edge. So that's just another decoration back there. Hmm. Well, I guess if there is anything that you can still do in this gigantic sand pit of an arena, then I don't... Let me look at this. His boss arena is like 15% of the entire Kalade. That alone is quite significant. <laughs> I don't... Has there ever been a FromSoft boss with a bigger arena? And no, I know I don't count open world bosses for that. Hmm. Yeah, but no. Nothing else to do here. Nothing else to do here after all. So I guess we are going to his tower again. Uh, I, wait, I think this was his tower, right? Yeah. The door should probably open up now. And once this is done, I do have a feeling, I do have a feeling that we will finally be able to open the other path then. Well, the, the one, what, what's it called? That one area where you we, do, we aren't able to go through before. The, oh, wait. Oh, that's the door. I don't know why I always think this wall is a door. It is kind of door shaped it's not shaped like a friend but rather like a door ah grand lift if only i could take you all the way down to finish exploring down there i guess i still need to finish exploring down there at some point Ooh, also i kind of hope you can i mean yes you can definitely buy his armor at the old lady's place we have seen as much already Ah, that was a fight. This one's definitely the hardest boss fight so far. I really liked it, but I think, I don't know why, but Tree Sentinel still has a special place in my heart. I don't know why I'm so emotionally attached to Tree Sentinel, the boss. Oh, I don't like this mist. Dangerous things can happen in the mist. Hello? Uh, is this a trap? No, I think you're just resummoning the lift. Oh wait, maybe these are clouds. We are quite high up after all. Try jumping. I don't think so, my lad. I don't think so. Ah, alright. Well, I, last time around I was in one of these towers. There were no enemies up top, so I'll just assume it's the same. This time again, right? Yeah, there is just a couple of fingers. Just a couple of fingers lying about. Restore the power of the Great Rune. Radan's Great Rune. Nice. So, what does it do now? I still want to know. As you do, as one does, yeah. Raises maximum HP, FP and stamina. Ah. I wonder by how much. That would be interesting to know. And also, I kind of want to head to the round table hold, because I feel like there should probably have happened something now that we actually completed that challenge. Ooh, also, we still have that boss that's up there. So let's go to the round table hold first, and then we can see if we are now feeling fit enough to defeat the boss over there. I mean, we just killed Radan, so... I am kind of on top of the world right now, but I also don't really want to get immediately humbled again. <laughs> and you know what, old lady, you're going to talk to me properly, right? What do you have to say now? Oh, nothing after all. Huh. Receive equipment of champions. Ah, yeah, there's Radan's gear. That's the helmet I definitely saw already. Kind of surprised that you can't buy Godric's gear, but I also assume Godric's gear would probably not look much like Godric's gear after you have ear mm, uh, without all of the arms. Because the arms were the only really significant thing. Receive power of remembrance. Eh, what could we get for you? Ooh. Is this the great sword that has just been nerfed or is this another one? Oh, it does actually have intelligence scaling, but the base requirements for strength are way too high for me. I also don't really care about the great bow, so I'm probably just going to crush both of you. 
Probably just going to crush both of those for souls. You know what? I just want to know how many souls are you worth? Yes. So the crafter is worth 20k. Oh Jesus, if the crafter is already worth that much, how much is Radan going to be worth? Yes. The answer is. Oh damn. Alright, alright. I think. Can we get two more level ups with this? I think we can. I think we can. Ah! Excellent, excellent leveling. Mm, I don't really like using unique items like that, but at the same time, it's like I was never going to use these great runes in the in for to get their items. Those are just not for my build. I was more than willing to use the one for, from Marika for her little spell, because that spell looked cool. But other than that, nah. Okay. Well, you don't say anything new about my success. So I will just move on. And we will just move on to the next boss. We do know of one more boss. And I still think I need to get to that little ruin. But for now, we are just going to try to defeat this guy. Because this guy, this guy has been a pain in my butt. So, drink your flask. Summon your skellies. Prepare your magic. Or the magic. And then it is time to kill some whatever this guy is. I would say some form of statue. And I just killed Radan, so I'm on top of the world. Yeah, okay. All these levels into int definitely did a number on my damage output. Oh, and my skeletons are almost dead. Maybe I'm getting humbled immediately. Oh, maybe I should have just gone for the spam instead of being fancy. Okay, we can definitely kill him now with all the extra magical damage we do. Hey, and my skeletons are back! Ow! I was distracted by my skeleton. No, not the Jack Skellingtons! <laughs> they were so culturally relevant! <laughs> but yeah, I can definitely see why so many people swear by the skeletons. Because let's be honest, the amount of damage that the summons do is not all that high. It's not. So I guess something that can tank for you will always be more worthwhile. And they just keep getting up and getting up and getting up. So then, my friend, round number two! And two! And okay, that's good damage, that's good damage right there, you see that? That's what we in the biz call good damage. Okay, Skellies, just be a good distraction, just be a distraction, yes. Get him to turn me his back on me. Oh, where the fuck are you, do you think you're going? Um. Oh, okay, can you get, okay, you, I think you can get up there again, but it's kind of weird, so I don't really dare approach you. Hmm. Okay, this might actually prove to be a very advantageous fighting position, unless of course he does that, because that one did hurt a lot last time around. Okay, so, well, I guess this is where we are fighting. Oh. Um, oh, I'm still hitting him! I'm still hitting him! We are still hitting him! Damn, did my spells always have this much range? Wait, does the range ow, get increased as well when you're leveling in? Oh, you're not doing much right now. I will take my chance here. Oh god, it was a trap. It was trickery. It was divine mockery, that's what it was. Okay, you killed one of my skeletons potentially, but not for good. Not for good, Black Blade King. Ow! Okay, once again I have been humbled. I'm lurking now, need to take on this out the trash. You continue to have fun, babe. Thank you, thank you. You, I hope I will be able to provide a, a, a fitting entertainment in your background. Always happy to be someone's background noise. Honestly, should I even take on this guy on foot now that I think about it? He's an open world boss, so maybe the secret lies in actually using my horse and just zoning the fuck out of him. So, let's 
give it one more shot with just hitting him. Okay, okay. Break up. Uh, oh. No. Oh. Okay, you're rolling away again. You're rolling away. Okay, I think I should get on the horse while he's down there. Oh god! Oh, it was a trap. It was an evil little trap. Okay, come down here. Would you be so kind? Uh, where are you? Oh, yeah, there. My skeletons are dying right now. But I think they still have a chance of getting back up. So if I can distract him a little, that would already be worthwhile. Oh, yeah, they are back up. Also, why is my lock on broken? Ow. Okay, this time I think I got killed by the lock on, it's fair to say. And I think I forgot to pick up my souls, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, are my souls lying around here somewhere? Yeah, I think I just lost them. Ah oh, well, nothing to do about that now. So with the, will the horsey be a good idea for this? Hmm. And I don't know. Doesn't really feel like a good horse boss. Mostly because... Ow. Ah, it overcast again. And my skeletons are going. Okay, you know what? Horsey time. It's horsey time. And... Ow. Okay, you hit my horse, but you didn't kill it. I can work with that. Can I cast while mid-air? No. I can't cast and jump. That's a shame. Oh! Ah! I just have to fight him the same way I just did Rodan. I'm pretty sure I can now kill him. I definitely have the damage for it. And I'm, he's definitely not stronger than Rodan. I can tell you that much for a fact. <laughs> so, let's resummon this. I should probably get on the horse. Yeah, let's, let's be on the horse right away. And then let's do this. Yes, my skelly boys. Get him. Get him. Ooh. Okay. And you are getting down there. I don't know if that one travels up, so I will be careful about it. And get behind, get behind him. He is doing a swing. And a big one. Oh, I think... Oh, no! I thought his AI was bugging out again, but he... He was just lying to me. He was just kind of trying to give me a sense of security. A sense of pride and accomplishment, one might say. Ah, Blackblade Kindred. Are we going to take more attempts at the Blackblade Kindred than we are at Radan? We might be. We might be. Hard to say yet. Hard to say yet. Alright, that's one thing done. Just get through the preparation. And then start the Moida. Bloody Moida. I mean, it's pretty decent that we can get at least 20% of his health bar down before he does anything. That does make this a lot easier. And as long as he is back turned on me, I guess we are out safe to wail on him. But if he does that, then yeah, that's another story. But to be fair, he didn't have his back turned on me, so my previous statement still stands. Oh! Okay, okay, he was just jumping to close the distance. Okay, be careful about what he does. Oh! Ooh! It was pure luck that I lived there. I think you should probably switch your weapon soon, right? feel like you are going to switch your weapons. Damn, you are doing a lot of the structural damage here, I have to say. Could you stop that? Oh. Ooh, that was an impressive attack. Uh, I think my skeletons are still trying to get up. Ow! Oh, you have a double spin now. All right. But that was our best attempt at this guy. I wonder how many souls we can get out of him. You are not a boss fight, you are just a walking level up, my friend. Because 
The dragon we fought near here was so far the thing that gave me the most souls out of everything. That was the dragon that gave me 80k souls. So I am kind of hoping to repeat that. Kind of hoping to get another 80k. Maybe even more because he does seem stronger than the dragon. But that might just be because I am very used to fighting dragons at this point. Okay, he is focusing on the skeleton. Ow! Oh, he is no longer focusing on the skeletons. Whoopa! Okay, get away from him. Get away from him. And then get the horse out again. Oh god, I hate when... I hate this question so much. This question probably killed more players than any mob. Ow! Ah, he's doing the spin to win. I'm a, an appreciator of the spin to win myself, but not when it gets used against me. Okay, you are doing the big... Oh, I are doing another... Oh, oh, I'm still alive, I'm still alive. All right. Oh, God. My horse is barely alive anymore. Could you focus on my skeletons again, like, for a few minutes? Ah, I think he's going for the skelly. Okay, that was the double he got me with last time around. He still has a lot of health left compared to my best attempt. But we are getting there, we are getting there again. Okay, both the skeletons are down, so be careful now. Tank some aggro to give them some time to build up again. Oh god. Ta don't tank that much aggro. Tank some aggro, but not that much. Ah, I mean, he does do more damage than Radan. You gotta hand it to him. He does one-shot me, and Radan was not able to one-shot me with every move. With a lot of moves, but not with every move. Oh, wait, that's not what I wanted to do. What did I want to do? Oh, right, resummon skellies. And we are ready yet again. I really wish I could level up the skeletons to the same level as the wolves. That would make them a lot more useful, I feel. Oh god, okay, you are just running around, right? Okay, you have your back turned on me. Oh no, you no longer have your back turned on me. Oh god, let's get down here. This is way too... That's not enough space to fight a guy like you in. And I think I'm not hitting you there. Yeah. I am not hitting you there. And I don't have magic anymore. Oh. Ooh. I think the skeleton staggered him there. And that's the only reason I didn't get hit. At least it felt like that. Oh, I am not shooting in the right direction. And he's doing the big swoop. Big swoop to loop. Okay, going well so far though. And that's the double. Oh, that's a triple. You do have a triple. I knew about your double. I did not know about your triple. Okay, drink up, drink up. We do need all the magic we can get. Oh, no. Oh, I recognized this move too late. In the middle of the cast, I was like, wait, he's gonna dive attack again, right? And then he did. And then he did. Ah, we could, of course, try to push on into the new area because I still am pretty sure that we can go there finally. I mean, we might have been able to go there beforehand as well. I'm not 100% sure because the big guy was telling me that the, the two fingers would block my path no longer. So maybe he was referring to something like that, but at the same time... I don't know, it, it felt like I had defeated the Witch Queen back then. Maybe he's just talking about the door inside. Ow! Ooh, ooh, okay, there goes my protection. Whoppa! Ooh, and there goes my horse. And whoppa! Okay, my life has not yet been gone. Okay. Still alive, and he switched his weapon. He switched his weapon. Oh, that's the dive, right? Yeah, that's the dive. And does not look like the dive has any form of follow up. So I appreciate that. And that's the triple spin, I think. Yeah. That's the triple. Oh, baby, a triple. Okay, okay. Good damage there, good damage there. Don't get impatient. Okay, my skeletons are probably done for. Uh, well, maybe one still has some life left in him. Okay, 
One skeleton can still do something. I don't know what it will do, but it will do something. Oh god, is this... Okay, no, it wasn't the spin. For a second, I thought... I think that's the problem. The first condi phase has conditioned me to assume his back with safety. But the second phase just uh, back spins. Well, it's not really a back spin. It's just an all-around spin. Oh, what are you... Oh, wait, you are switching. Oh, you have a third phase now. Okay, I don't know the third phase yet at all. Interesting. I still have a skeleton in the ring, so... Oh. The fact that you are dodging a lot right now kind of makes me worry about my magic management here. Okay, got two more hits in. Drink a flask. Oh, and you are switching weapons again, alright. I think you are not dodging as much with this weapon. And out of the way, out of the way. And one and a two. All right, all right, we are getting there. We are getting there. Okay, that's just a double spin. Just a double spin. And, oh, we missed. Oh, you are going for... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh, he still aimed for the skeleton props. Oh, I'm so lucky. That would have been my end. That would have been my end if he actually aimed at me. Okay, so... Oh, oh, he's focused on the skeleton. He's focused on the skeleton. Ooh. Ooh, you're doing a big thing. And um, where's my magic? Where are my attacks? Come on. And we defeated him. Ah, another one down. How many souls are you worth, huh? 88,000. Gargoyle's Black Blade and Gargoyle's Black Halberd. Hallelujah. All right, so the boss was actually worth more than Radan. <laughs> So, and time to find out if the Grand Lift of Dactos finally works. Now that you've wrapped up the last loose end. No loose ends in the family. <laughs> and that should net me a few more level ups. I think at least two, maybe a few runes, a third one. Hey, and I need... Roughly 7k souls for yet another one. That's not too bad. It sounds bad, but then we have to remind ourselves it's not too bad. Because we have this! Ah, uh, 12 runes. Nice. And we've hit level 50 with intelligence. That was where I wanted to get. Because I have been told there should be a staff at some point that I Oh, wait! Now that I think about it, we still have a loose end. We haven't explored the city of the mages yet, like, at all. And that's probably a place I need to explore. Okay, so, first things first. Since we are here already, let's take a little bit of a peek. Let's see if we can actually get through here now. The Grand Lift of Dactus. Oh, now that I think about it, wasn't that something about me gesturing required ahead? Okay, let's see if that's correct. I don't quite know which gesture that is, but we might as well try. I think it might be Rapture. So let's see, does that do anything? The answer is... Does not look like it. Well, I have been fooled and bamboozled. Now that I think about it, wasn't there something about me needing to find the second half of those medallions? Something like that? Ah, uh, where are they? There, yeah. The deck those joins medal to... Oh, all right. Oh, fucking hell. Where in the world am I going to find the right half of this? Like literally, that's a small broken in half medallion. And that's a big ma hey, Where's my big map? There it is. Where in the world do I need to go now? Huh. I... Guess we can just explore the mage city. The right half of the deck does lift medallion. Maybe it's here the mage city. It is one of the last areas that we haven't explored yet. The K in the Kaelid. 
In the Kaled. Ah, let's just hope for the best, I guess. Oh! Oh! No! Not like this! You think you can defeat me with your feeble spells? I am the master spellcaster. And you have be Okay, you can go invisible. Fair enough. That's annoying. Annoying little bugger. Don't... Oh! There you are. You are not going invisible again. But yeah, I'm definitely well, better equipped to deal with this area now. Cast the fight! Cast the fight! Ca oh! <laughs> no, there was an invisible guy in the way. Okay, so I think we should progress slowly around these parts. Mostly because we can get circled by a group of invisible enemies at any given point. Which is never ideal. Okay, that's the main gate that I originally came into. Well, came into, came through. I came into the city and I went through the gate. Oh, and oh, and okay, no more. There we go. Ooh, what do we have here? A door that's not openable, okay. Who else is here? Who else is here? Someone's here, I know it. I can feel it in me guts, in me stomach. Ah, like you! Oh. Okay, you hit me once, fair enough. I hit you fry, so I think I'm still the winner overall. Also, I'm still alive, you ain't. And, oh, read message. Ah, yes, classic, you don't have to write. Classic. It just gets funnier every single time I see it. Just gets funnier. Uh, so is every anything up here? Hmm, no. Surprisingly enough, it isn't. What if, well, maybe there was an item up here that I already collected. I can't say that for sure. I guess I'll just keep on exploring the city then. The magical city around these... Oh! Oh! No! Ah, there we go. Mad flailing saves the day yet, yet again. Oh, but yeah, this city definitely feels way less intimidating after everything I have been through at this point. I don't know why, but I really struggle to, with plunging attacks in this game. I feel like I should be able to pull them off, but I don't think... Well, maybe, maybe I've managed to do one plunging attack yet, but... Not any of these ones, I can tell you for sure. Okay, that's just the next funny you don't have the right message, I'm sure. Oh! Oh, whatever! Where did you come from? You ugly mud. Oh, uh, okay, we are... Okay, the thing I was worried about happened, we have been surrounded. We have been surrounded and we are out of magic. I don't know where the other guy is, so let's drink our flask. Oh! Oh! You're using the big swing. Ah! There you are! There you are, my lad! Okay, then drink up and kill the mage that's over there somewhere. Hello! Ah, there you are. Mappa! I know that spell by now. I think you need something new. So, and I'm kind of running around the sea. Oh! Hello! Invisible enemies are a pain in the butt. Oh, I do hear someone else casting at me. And he is right there. There we go. Oh, and another invisible guy. You can never f really feel safe. First off, dashing through except try. Wait, what? Try, sir? What? Okay, maybe the speedrun strats here. Maybe the speedrun strats. But we ain't no speedrunner. We definitely ain't no speedrunner. Not at 44 plus hours into the game without. Having finished it, well, speedrunners are beneath half an hour by this point. Hmm. Oh, I see an item up there. How do I get up there? Maybe I can jump on this tree. I I think that was almost correct. Oh, also, there is a guy. Oh, you hit me once. Fair enough. And there's one more of you. Oh, two more of you. 
but you're also doing way less damage to me right now than you used to do so even if you get a hit in it's not as grave as it used to be because i think the first time i was here they were able to two shot me which is never good when it comes to basic enemies so i still want to get up there uh can i summon my horse up here i think i have the horse up here already ah well that worked out somehow toxic uh what kind of enemy is that a dead one good <laughs> my favorite kind of enemy so i guess we are going assassin's creed now and exploring the rooftops because I have not found anything on the ground yet. Okay, I see an item over there. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck are you? Ugly, that's what you are. I can tell you that much. So, I wanted to get to the item over there. And I think someone... Ah, uh, yeah, someone else was moving over here. Oop. Ah! Okay, one shot would have been enough with magic. Wasn't sure, wanted to make sure before I lost its position again. And uh, didn't I see an item here? Ah, oh, there it is. What item are you? Are you a medallion? You're a stone sword key. Under most circumstances, I would be very happy about the stone sword key. But given the fact that I kind of need something very specific right now, I guess most items will end up being disappointments. Oh, what's this? Oh, there we go. A seal was broken in town somewhere. Great. That's great to hear. I think... Okay, I can't summon torrent up here. I want to jump over there and take care of the beetle before it despawns. Or I forget about it. Uh, no invisible enemy, apparently, surprisingly enough. Give me your loot! Oh, wait, let's try this one again. Give me your loot! Alright, maybe I need another position. Maybe I need to find some higher ground somewhere. Ooh! Ooh, oh, oh. Okay, be careful there. And... Now you give me your loot. Thank you. Double slash. Alright. I should also drink a flask. So, one of those skates has been broken. No, I... Do I... Do I have this? Oh yeah, okay, I do have that grace already. I wasn't sure for a second. Hmm. I guess I should try to get down again now that I actually need to find an entrance somewhere. Uh, let's see. Let's have a little bit of a jump around. Ah, I got there. Oh. Oh. Staff of L Ooh, we found another staff. Let's take a look at it, because these guys don't seem to be able to hit me. Staff of Loss, where are you? There you are. Intelligence scaling of C as a basis and strength plus deck scaling. Interesting. Pretty strong base sorcery scaling. Not too shabby. They don't know if it will be useful if I upgrade it, but not too shabby right now. Okay, you know what? I don't appreciate your attitude yet right now, young man. Ow! I, there was another one behind me, right? Ah, yeah, I see you. I... I... Oh! Okay, I, I will just assume this was the gate we opened, because I doubt this was just standing around in the open here. Spell Drake Talisman. Ooh. New Talisman. Greatly boost. Ah, okay, it's for defense. I for, for a second, I read Greatly Boost Magical Damage, and I was like, Hell yeah, brother! But then it was. Oh, negation. But still, that will be more useful than the focus thing here. Because. I mean, probably because I still don't know what focus does in this game. So I guess I'm going to have a look around to see where else we can light some t t torches to open up the rest of the magical seals. 
There was a guy up here, I do remember that. Where are you? Come on, my lad. We both know how this is going to end. I wouldn't want to face me either, so I do get it. But come on now. Don't have to... Oh, I see the neck. Ah, there you are. What? Oh, no. You are... <laughs> okay, yeah. These, uh, these uh, player shades can be quite uh, jump scary in a town full of ghosts. Okay, be careful. Be careful. And then double jump. Oh. Ah, we got there. We did get there. No idea which of the barriers this one is going to lift, but it will definitely lift yet another barrier. And so far, both of the flames have been up high. So I should maybe look around. Okay, I guess that thing over there will have another flame in it. And... Hmm... Okay, it's hard to see from in here, but this is our next target. So we are going to stay on the rooftops, I guess. We are going to do that. Climb over there. I mean, we're going to double jump over there, most likely. Come on, come on. Also, if any one of you wants to tell me where I find that second seal, then feel free to, because there's a big world out there. And I have no idea where I could go to find it. Mm, also, I'm not going to get there from over here. And I will be honest with you, I am sure as hell not going to run around uh, and checking out every centimeter of this entire game just to find one item you literally can't progress without. Would have expected to get that more along the main storyline somehow, to be honest. Uh, ah, there we are. I mean, it might still be here in the city, we don't know yet. Might still be here in the city. And another seal was broken. So is there another tower left? Uh, that thing over there could be one? How would I go up there if if it was one? Also, the message. Could you disappear kindly, sir? Uh, let's take... Where is it? Where is it? Where is my beloved telescope? There it is. Okay, that's something, but that does not look like a torch I need to light. Hmm. I mean, we have two broken seals up right now, so I guess we should go down to street level again and see where those actually open up. Because this entire... Oh! Hello there! Oh, oh, oh! Have I not been here before? Where are you, my invisible adversary? Oh! No! No! You're not gonna do that! Ow! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, careful now, careful now! Heal up and... You are out. Oh, I missed you at the at close range, sadly enough. And one more, come on, one more. Okay, there we go. Whew, you had me scared there, laddies. I mean, the torches wouldn't go out, I assume, even if I got killed. But at the same time, all the enemies that I've gotten rid of so far would respawn. And I really don't want... Ooh. I think we might have opened up a boss room. Huh. Okay, if we open up a boss room. Okay, you know what? Let's mark this here, just so we don't forget where exactly in the city it is. We are going to do the boss room, no worries. Assuming it is a boss room, it might be something else entirely, who knows. But let's have more of a look around first and see if we missed anything else. If there even are any seals left. Because I haven't seen a seal in a... Ah! This looks like there was another seal in front of here. Oh, we found a spell! Lovely! There is little that excites me more to find than a new spell. But we might have opened up everything now. Alright. 
So, let's rest at the bonfire real quick and then I guess it's boss time. Didn't expect to find a boss here, if I'm completely honest. I didn't, don't know what exactly I expected to find, but a boss was not one of these the things. Yeah, and I'm just going to run through now. You might have respawned, but my care of about you has not. So, what do we have here? What do we have here? Alright, it's Nox Priestess and Nox Sword Stress. Never heard the word Sword Stress before. Okay, you know what? This is Skeleton Times. You uh, have two people, I have three now. This seems like a lot more of a fair fight now. Also, let's see if you can dodge the... Co yeah, now you're doing the big thing where you dodge too soon when my spell is delayed. Haha! -ha! Okay, so Skelly Boys, you just do... You just keep doing your thing, I am going to finish this little gal off. Okay, that's one of the you dealt with. And yeah, <laughs> I might be a little over leveled for this area. Oh, you are still doing a shit ton of damage. Maybe I should scale Vigor at some point. Goodbye. All right, was that the warm up round or is there an actual boss fight still waiting for me? Nox Flowing Sword. I mean, there's a grace here. And there is a chest. Okay, I guess that was just a boss fight. And we have... Ooh. Alright. Lucent glintstone stuff. What do you do? Intelligent scaling B. Intelligence requirement 52. Jesus Christ. I do have a feeling that this might be the stuff people have been talking about. Because I do remember that there was a stuff that's kind of considered to be the end game sorcery stuff that had an intelligence requirement of above 50 and, and glintstone in the name. I don't know for sure, but it feels very much like it. It's always a little hard to say as long as you don't quite see where the scaling ends up once you level up the actual weapon. So is there anything else around here? I kind of doubt it. Good thing that we did still explored this. Oh, is there something left here? There's a sh oh wait, no, it's just pathetic sword, yeah. All right, so I guess we can go back to the round table hold and actually see if we can upgrade that thing. But where are we going to find that talisman? Hmm. Maybe I'll just Google it before the next stream that might happen. So we are just going to finish off everything around here and start uh, next time. Once we know where the talisman is, we could go for it and actually get some shit done. <coughs> Uh, where is the smith? I think over there, right? Oh wait, you will want souls as well. I mean, it's not really important to upgrade it right now, because I don't have the souls anyway. Strength and armament. Are you a strengthenable thing? Uh, where are my staffs? Am I scrolling past them? Did I scroll past them? No, seriously, where are my staffs? Oh, there they are. Oh, yeah, they count. Okay, makes sense that they count as a ranged weapon. So, what do you need to be upgraded? Just Somber Smithing Stone 1, Somber Smithing Stone 2. Almost missing someone free. Ah, and there we are. S scaling for intelligence and D scaling for strength. I still don't quite know why. Well, are we sure this is the one? How's the sorcery scaling? Not all that impressive. So maybe I just wasted a shit ton of. Well, a shit ton. A few glint stones on a staff that's not actually good. Hmm. Did that happen? Maybe. 
I mean, it does have, it still does have an S scaling right now. Why is sorcery scaling so bad though? Like seriously, I would have expected this. Usually sorcery scaling got increased when I leveled the stuff because look at it. Or is it maybe that I, it doesn't scale well right now because I don't have the meta requirements. That might have something to do with it. Because that's the only reasonable explanation I have right now for all these trashy stuffs to scale worse than my actually good one. Hmm. Oh, and that's Spike Palisar shield we got. That's cool looking. Okay, well, with these things out of the way, uh, can I level up my skeletons right now? No, I need Grave Glow Worth. No idea where to get it. Maybe one of the merchants potentially sells it, but that's something I would probably check in my offline time. Just travel around and see. Do you have anything new to say now, by the way? I doubt it because I didn't... Huh. No. I would like to journey to the capital, my lad. I really would. But you're making this... N you don't make... Nah, you're not making it easier by not giving me what I need to do. Oh, well. I mean, it's half past ten and we have been going for three and a half hours and I do have work tomorrow. So I think we are probably going to wrap it up here. But we did get a lot of shit done. We pretty much did everything that we still wanted to do in what I would consider will be the old world pretty soon. Because we are going to get past the Grand Lift of Dectos. Hopefully next stream hopefully hopefully no guarantees though ah it's a little bit of a shame i would have loved to see the area would have loved to see whatever's coming up next but what can you do what can you do so let's wrap this up folks let's wrap it up folks we had our fun today it was a good stream it was a productive stream we did a lot of things we did a grand many things but as always all good things have to come to an end at some point so let's see if there is something one to raid hey yes it was nice what well, yes it was nice so i'm definitely not going to raid froggy again i love froggy but i've raided her twice over the last week just because i, I was safe to raid her and wouldn't i wouldn't spoil myself <laughs> on the uh, on on Amp anderson ring content because i know with her that she's behind me so we are going to raid rococo Rococo is a fun VTuber, it's a clown VTuber, which might sound a little daunting at first, but you'll see, you'll see, Rococo is a cool gal. So I will see you around uh, next Monday is when the next stream will be happening, and until then, have a nice weekend, bye!